Welcome back, Commanders, to the XCOM project. How you doing? Welcome back. It's good to be back. Man, a week, a week goes so quickly sometimes, you know? Depends what you're doing, but I feel like I was here moments ago. Oh, how you going? How's it going? What's going down in streaming town? Welcome. Let's have a little um, reminder of where we're at. We're, um... We're at the beginning of month three, and we're playing 40k mod pack. And we have picked to play as the Emperor's Holy Inquisition, which gives us the Imperial Smorgasbord of units. We get Guardsmen, we get Ogrens, we get Sisters of Battle, we get Stormtroopers, we get Space Marines! We get all the things. So, it's tricky though, because we can't recruit in the regular way. We can't just buy in new recruits. We have to research them in as we appeal for reinforcements. So we're having to be a bit bit cagey with our boys. We can recruit uh, Death, Gu Death Watch Space Marines, but we're limited to five a month at the moment. And a month is a long time. There's a lot of battles. Um, so we've got the main base, Redacted HQ, which is already filled up. But the new lab goes online pretty soon, so we're going to need to buy... Did we buy the Adepts already, or do we still have to buy them? Uh, no, we've already bought them. Okay, cool. So as soon as that lab comes online, we are good to go. Uh, we've got a secondary base, which is our Factorium Alpha. It's really just a, a training camp. We've got five, six, seven guys here. What is it? Oh, yeah, it's, it's a battle sister leading six Death Corps of Krieg. Um, they're garrisoned here. They should all be in training. Do I have to click a button for that? I've forgotten how it works. Hopefully they do it automatically. Um, what have we got? We did leave them enough weapons here, didn't we? We left them a sniper, a power fist, a Tanith las gun, some guard las guns. Uh, a couple of heavy stubbers. They'll be fine. Uh, is this just the beginning? Uh, yeah, you've missed uh, two months. So the real early stage missions. You missed a couple of massacres. It's gone... Uh, we've had a mixed bag. We've had some very good missions. We've had some very bad missions. But it's still fairly early days. You haven't missed anything on this stream. We literally haven't left this screen. And then over in um, Not America, we've got our new outpost base is almost online. Um... So we're going to have to save up some space bucks to load this place out. Because they've got nothing here right now. No no people, no weapons, no aircraft yet. But I reckon if we can save up some money, get a couple of planes here with our radar system, we can start protecting Not America. Uh, oh, wow. Streaks. Nice. Ten stream streak. Congrats. Three stream streak. Very nice. Uh, what are we researching? Oh, we wanted some Sisters of Battle. Oh, that's right. We tried to get the Sisters in at the end of last stream, but they didn't arrive on time. Um, That's fine. They'll be here soon. Because we've got missions to do, right? We've got... The Space Hulk has crashed over in Not America. Um, We've found uh, some kind of traitor guard base up here in the north. But then... I sent my plane out to look for a base, and it has identified a enemy base three, which means not only have we found a new base, but there's probably an enemy base two out there somewhere as well. So we've got to be careful about that. But before we can worry about these bases, we've got to do the Space Hulk, because if we don't deal with this... Oh. Well, if we don't deal with the Space Hulk, we lose 500 points. Bum, 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 bum. Wow. There's 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 500 points uh, down the drain. Nice. Feels fucking bad. Oh well. Such are the bureau bureaucratic delays in his <laughs> emperor's most holy of orders. Sometimes the paperwork gets delayed. You know. Sometimes a servitor has a paper jam. Can you do? Uh, wait, what should we do? Base number one, I think, is a Chaos Cult base. And base number three, I think, is a Traitor Guard base. I'm just guessing. Um, ah, 
Ha! Oh, I'm good at fucking finding bases, man. I'm real good at it. Okay. We found three bases. Uh, well. Okay, in the morning. In the morning we go for base number one, I guess. We just work our way through. We can get those points back. I've got no idea what these bases are like. Oh, very small. Scramble. Scramble the sector. Beep, 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 beep. Get him. That is loud. Why is that so loud? Uh, audio. Fix. Okay. They might be easy bases. This is true. They might not be like XCOM, like alien bases. We'll give it our best shot. We've got, we've got a Death Watch squad ready to go. I wouldn't want to be like a Chaos Cult having to defend against a, um, a Death Watch kill team. That sounds fucking horrible. Why is it the Corvus Black Star 2? Oh yeah, we got a second plane, didn't we? Forgot we had a second plane. That's fun. Uh... Right, who's on board? It's filled up with uh, many brothers. Yeah, so it's my Inquisitor, my medical stormtrooper, a uh, an Imperial assassin, and like eleven Space Marines. That works. Um, now. I can't remember what I gave everyone before, but mostly bolt guns with a couple of close combat guys seems fine. Got one heavy weapon, one flamer. It's like a basically it's a tactical squad, isn't it? Seems fair. Seems to work. Uh, Trapo, are you injured still? Uh, where's my Trapo at? Trapo, you're back. You're back on the line. You're first in. That's you. Can I get mechan Mechanicum units? You can have Servitors. Uh, that's all I've seen from Mechanicum in this. Maybe. It's a massive mod pack. I definitely haven't seen everything yet. Um, right. Black Star away. All right. If we get rid of these bases, we can sort this out. I think all the interceptors will stop launching once the bases are done. Oh no, Chaos Cult detected! Do we redirect? No, we're en route. We'll just have to do two on the trot. Who's even left? Could we fill the second ship? Uh, we could have two Space Marines. Three, four, five, six, seven Marines, two Stormtroopers. We could. We could just do ship two, you know. Uh, ten guys? We might have taken all the good weapons with us on the first ship, though. I didn't think about this. Uh, can power armor use assault cannons in this mod pack? I feel like that's a fair question. Um... Let's find out. Carry a rotor cannon? That's pretty fun. Uh, artifacts pattern bolt gun, maybe? Lock pattern? Sure. Is that a light bolter? Don't know. I can I can never keep keep my brain straight on what, what's a light bolter and what's not. Uh, we'll take a support servitor. Sure. Um, we may end up with a bunch of unarmed guys. I guess we can take the light the light bolters as well. Just in case. Um 
really not doing good inventory management, I have to admit. Bring a rocket launcher. See what happens. And some last guns. Uh, Right, B, the B team. B team is going to Chaos Cult activity ritual. All right, A team is go. You don't know what it is, but I remind you of Ewan McGregor's Obi Wan today. Hello there. Thank you. That's literally the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. I appreciate that. Thank you, Squidoo. Very kind. Uh, right. Our troops have arrived at the location of fortifications inhabited by traitor guardsmen. Purge the traitors for their heresy. Destroying the communications equipment at the center of the outpost will render the base inoperative. The mission will terminate when all enemies are eliminated or when your troops return to the craft. Uh, we already checked this, didn't we? I think we're good to trot. Hot to trot. Let's go. To battle. Oh, wow, okay, it's like a proper traitor guard base. Okay, this shouldn't be too bad, unless they've got, like, tanks or sentinels here. Then it's going to be fucking awful, because I didn't bring any anti-armor. Hmm. Um, it's the robe. <laughs> you don't want to sell me death sticks. Is that what it was? Um... Okay, let's head out there. Eldritch Nerd. What have we got? Seven enemies spotted already. Uh... <laughs> that mostly makes you think people aren't nice to me. Yeah, that's pretty much. Pretty much. That's how it goes. Get out of here, Sniperman. Sniper Lady. Oh my god. Okay. They may be crap. There are... There, oh my god, there's a... Like a Laz Cannon team. Uh... Okay, what have we... We've got a sniper, haven't we? Uh... Can Mr. Palpato? Of course they can. Right, Death Cult Assassin. I choose you. Go for glory. For you, sir. I salute you. Right, I think Mr. Papato is going to live in this little bunker here. Since they're basically out of time units. Hopefully that'll give him some kind of protection. Uh... Right, we've got to get someone with range to knock out that Laz Cannon team. Where's Gortef? There he is. Okay, get out of the way, Rax Manlar. Gortef's coming through. Now, he needs 87 to take an aimed shot. Oh my goodness. No line of fire course. Yeah, okay, no aimed shots today, so snapshots probably not even worth it. Nope. Shit. How do we want to deal with that thing? Okay, we'll run out here. Get behind this. Whoa. Okay, Gortef. Whoa. Crouch down. Uh, hmm. We're just gonna. I didn't bring any smoke grenades. I don't think I've researched them. Flamer's definitely not gonna do much right now. That's for sure. Uh, 
I don't want to give him any, like, shots I don't have to give him. If we sprint. Whoa! Ow! Quit it! Shot in the back. I just want to make sure the Laz Cannon can't just wreck me. Wow, everyone's having a bloody go. Uh, well, our back armor's damaged. Oh, and our front armor's damaged too. Delightful. Um, get out of the fire. Gleaming Egypt. Leona Frost sprints. They can hit this guy once. Doesn't feel like a great trade. Sprinting is the worst. Uh, but if we walk to like here, get, Leona Frost can try and cap this guy twice. Oh, and he needed one. Oh my god, Leona Frost with the double pistol. Amazing. Okay, and then we need some more of that spirit. We need you all to sing the canticle of aimed shot benediction or whatever the fuck it is you guys need to do to hit something. <sighs> trapo, I've got a bad feeling about this Trapo. I'm not going to lie. Someone's got to shoot that Laz cannon. And today, that person is you. Aim true, brother! <laughs> wow. Wow, 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 wow. Uh... Alright. Dolphin safe. Show us the meaning of rapid fire. One critical hit. I'll take that for zero percent volley. I will take that. Sneaky get, please. Two percent, Jesus. Take the shot. Okay, that last cannon is really the only thing that matters right now, to be honest. Uh... <laughs> Trapo says they're an ultramarine, so they should survive through the power of plot armor. I mean, that I can see the logic. Fingers crossed that pans out. But that, that does mean that basically everyone else has to die instead of you. Oh, Nivrat! Medic kill. Very cool. Alright, time for Ted Danger. Sniper extraordinaire. They call me Ted Dangerous. Take the shot, Ted. We just have to advance in column formation with everyone behind you. That is very noble of you, sir. Appreciate your sacrifice. Alright then, Darren F. Haven't left enough time units to turn. A fool of a took. Alright, Ace Dragon. You're going out there as well with your pistol. Uh... 
Good luck. Shit. Okay, Axel. Axel, you are literally our last best hope for life. If you can't do this, Axel, many, many deaths. Not a sniper though. Not too shabby. Oh, may the Emperor be with you. Your face is your shield, brothers. Oh, a wizard. God, they have to save the last cannon for last, don't they? They're just trying to psych me out. Oh! Oh! We didn't die. Who got hit there? It looked like someone got hit. Is it sneak sneaky get? Sneaky get tanked something to the face. Oof. Good thing it was the last cannon. Uh, Ted Danger. Ted Danger took the hit. They rolled a one to wound Ted Danger. Oof. Okay. We just got to kill it this turn. We do not give them any more chances. Oh. Oh, shit, it's solid snake. Get him, Ace Dragon. Oh, Ace Dragon, what a hero. Good Space Marines, man. Pretty fucking strong. Okay, let's get through that fire. Come on, Rex. Show them what salamanders are made of. Oh, nice try. Okay, who's who's having their first pop of this? Pravul, Pravul. Shot Pravul. Hey, to hit. It's the start. Oh, oof. <laughs> Sneaky get. Very. Not that sneaky, but definitely a get. Uh, we need 56. Okay. I'll have to do. Okay. This is going to be a long day, isn't it? I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. Jesus. Now he's got his gun shield turned around. I've got a feeling he's a lot tougher. Uh... Oh, hang on. We got the sniper. Gortef. This is literally what you're here for. The fuck was that? Idiot. Uh... Marines, they need they need tough love. It's the only way they'll listen. Jesus, yeah, that gun shield. That gun shield knows how to really rustle my jimmies. <laughs> it's such a target-rich environment. You literally can't miss. Even if you can't hit the thing you're aiming for, you're gonna hit something. Love that. Grenades. We could try grenades. I don't know how far you can throw them. What do they need? Someone else is going to have to throw it. Has anyone got any time units left? Jesus. Um... 
Who else can pick that up? None of these guys. Jeez, did I just buzz through all the space marines? Yep, yep, I did. Uh... Okay. Let's see how far our Inquisitor can throw grenades. Not that far, that's for sure. Let the purgation begin. Nope. Nope. Just nope. Oh my god, there's another Laz Cannon. Fuck. Okay, well, Nifrat, you just you just hang tight. I'm sure you're gonna be needed very shortly. Uh do we just run the assassin? No, even the assassin can't get there. Oh my god. Right, join my death cult. Excellent. Your application is approved. You, join my death cult. Oh, your application has failed. Uh, shit. You're getting dinged. You just get closer. Fuck it. Yeah, I know if, if we drop that grenade, it will explode. What was that? Wizards! Heresy! Ooh, they're already breaking morale. Good stuff. Uh, but I moved my Inquisitor far enough away. He's holding a crack grenade. They've got very short blast radius. No one else should get hurt if, if he dies. Amazing. Half of them are already giving up. None can stand against space marines. Oh, no. I've given them the idea. They've remembered about grenades because of me. Doesn't explode until let go. Yeah, exactly. That's right. Uh, how bad was it? Rax. Rax took seven lethal wounds. Owie. Owie powie. Okay, pull back, Rax. Get to the chopper. Right, then get over here, Nivrat. We've got important boo boo kissing to achieve. One kissed boo boo. You must wait for more later. Okay, right, we're recruiting again, guys. Join my death cult! Application successful! Application successful. Wow, we got so many members of our death cult now. Can't wait. Looks like they're trying to stun us with those heretical wizard spells. Guys, you can't, you can't keep doing this. I mean, oh my god, is this thing literally bolter proof? I feel like it might be. Um, we should probably be getting closer to it, but I don't know, man. Feels real bad. Um... All right, just keep on going, Ace Dragon. I don't think the last cannons panic. I've got a feeling they count as like vehicles and are therefore immune to morale. Is my theory. Every every time we've hit it, we've done zero damage. Uh, we're gonna have to deploy heavier weaponry.
Come on, dolphin safe. Light it up. Yeah, we do need armor pissing. I didn't bring any other kind of ammo. So we're going to have to go with the the Inquisitor's Hail Mary f pass for 38 time units. Uh, come on. Oh, out of range. Uh, Okay, wish us luck. <laughs> Hide behind that bit of ruin. Just make your five up cover saves. Everything will be okay. I promise. I promise. Uh, who's even left? Axel. Palpato. Okay, Palpato's actually in a spot where they might be able to do something next turn. We prime their grenade. Okay. All right, we've got them surrounded now. As long as Palpato doesn't go down, everything's going to be okay. We didn't kill anyone this turn, did we? Jeez. Feels bad! Oh! Wizard! Wizard panicked. Hmm. Uh. Oh no! They're grenading back! Shit. No one died. Nobody died. It's, it's okay. Palpato is... Wow. Palpato is amazing. They must have just backflipped their way out of grenade range. He... Fucking crack grenade. Uh, I could prime another grenade, but I wouldn't have time to throw it. Back behind cover. Uh, is one crack grenade going to be enough? Or sh should I throw two? Um, I think we we do we do two. To be on the safe side. Ha! <laughs> Hildridge nerd! What the fuck was that? <laughs> it was pitiful. Jesus. Um. Well, good thing we had two grenades to throw, really, isn't it? Right. Kiss those boo boos. Is it somewhere close? It's there. Like two squares away? My crack grenades have got really small area of effect, so that might do something. Take me into battle. It might not. How the gruesome twosome. <gasps> I think they're throwing frag grenades. And I think space marines don't give a shit about frag grenades. Chop. Okay. Well, at least the assault squad's doing work. I wish I could say the same for shoot squad. Because we're just not operating at optimal range. Let's be generous, shall we? Uh, Jesus, there's so many. It's 
just so many enemies. Uh... None may stand against space marines. Deploying now, brother. Fifty-two to shoot. My god, this fucking guy. I think we've shot them like four times. Like hit them four times. Oof. Oh, Rax, you just got here, Rax. Your guy, you ran up and flamed a couple of dudes, but then you just got the shit shot out of you. And um, we had to run you home. You had seven fatal wounds. But luckily you got... Um, you got back to the ship, and the Nivrat's been kissing all your boo-boos the last two turns. It was a close one. Uh, you're the, definitely the like the most wounded guy of this whole mission. Uh, <laughs> seven fatal wounds, nothing a Lucasade won't fix. Yeah, exactly, just walk it off. You'll be fine. Weapons ready. Understood. Uh, Gortev hasn't hit a single fucking thing today. There we go. Laz cannon down. They're afraid. Okay. We just gotta knock out that other Laz cannon, and then I think we can just walk up and stab everyone in sight. We need to bring, like, a rocket launcher. Hey! <laughs> Excellent work, deserters. Excellent fucking work. <laughs> oh, it's nice to have some good news for once. Just panic shot. Shot him right in the back, ignoring the gun shield. Oh. That was beautiful. Glad these heretics deserted the Emperor. I don't want them in our armies. Ready for duty. Uh... Weapons ready. God. Leona Frost and Ace Dragon are racking up the kills here. They've just stormed this whole flank together. Nothing's come even close to slowing them down. Sure will. Look at them fall. Look at them all fall. Let them fall before us. Ready to serve. Go get them, Palpato. Actually, Nivrat, you've got one more boo boo to kiss, haven't you? Mwah! Okay, Rax Manla, ready for duty. Get out there, champ. Show them what you got. Waggle your spout like a teapot man. Deploying now, brother. <laughs> oh my god, okay. This is like a turkey shoot now. Now that they're afraid and they've lost their heavy weapons. Moving out. Uh. Enemy located. Go get him, sneaky get. If 
feel bad as a deserter. I reckon they've fought for the Imperial Guard for years. And I bet not once have they seen a single Space Marine come to help them. But the moment they desert, the same fucking day, a whole squad of ten turns up to execute them. It's got to feel real bad. Just like buses. <laughs> Destination it's true. Space Marines are just like buses. should just surrender now. I feel like if every one of your guys panics in the same turn, it should just be a game over. It should be like instant, instant GG. Shouldn't be long now. Well, that's the panicking machine gunner. Let's take care of him in case he rallies. God. Death Cult Assassins are pretty cool. Let's get Darineth. Your job is door opener. Make it so. Aldrich Nerd. Now the way is open. If you could just fill that bunker. Full of heavy bolter rounds. Thank you very much. And... Oh my god, this, this is a blessed guardsman. We fired quite a lot at that guy. This is, some, this is like me rolling dice for my space marines. Hey, there we go. How many more guys could they have, really? <laughs> Feels bad. enough? We got him! Um, huzzah! 570 points! Rating excellent! 38 kills! Whew. That's a lot of kills! Jeez. Uh, loads of level ups. Well done, everyone. Rax did not level up at all. Gortef did not level up at all. That makes sense. Uh... <laughs> yeah, you'd think, Rax, you'd think you'd have got some extra health points after, like, surviving bullets, right? I feel like if you survive enough bullets, you get immune to them. Yeah, it would require Gortef to actually hit something to level up, that's true. Um... Right, let's sell all these corpses. Oh, we didn't take any prisoners. Shit. Forgot about that. Definitely sell all the chaos heretical weapons.
battle tested. GG, good work. Alpha Squad returned. Beta Squad. Let's see how Beta Squad gets on with the um, Chaos Cult ritual. Uh, rumors from righteous Imperial citizens have led us to this location. With the sighting of a heretical Chaos Cult members, their fears are confirmed. Some dark ritual is in its early stages. Purge these traitors and remove their blight from our planet! Strike quickly, lest their incantations come to fruition. The mission will terminate when all enemies are eliminated. Um... Ah, oh, Yarl Lewis. Are you here, Lewis? What, what gun? What's your gun of choice? Squatosaurus Rex, he's packing their heavy bolter, although he's not really strong enough for it, but... Oh well, he's claimed it first. He got dibs. Um, power users here with a hell gun. Looking good. Uh, Solipus with a knife. You can do better than that. You can have an eviscerator Solipus. Uh, Zargosian wants the Godwin Diaz pattern bolt gun, apparently. Which uses light bolter ammo. Zargosians stun the enemy. That's that's what, how we remember that. Uh, Lokvik. Hmm. Take me into battle. You want an assault cannon and power fist. <laughs> the power fist is not on this ship, sadly. But we can see if he can give you the assault cannon. So Jesus. Wrench monkey. Wrench monkey's actually got good accuracy. Let's try giving them the um, the missile launcher. Let's pack it with frags. Let's bring one crack as a treat. Um, in. In gets the chain gun. And can't fit any ammo for it. Uh, Jusb. Oh, Jub's got the jetpack. They can rock a light bolt gun. Why not? Uh, yeah, you don't... Oh my god. I was going to say, you don't have to be a Terminator, but it helps. That is like double your weight allowance, my dude. <laughs> um, are you sure you still want it? You're going to be very slow. You're going to get real sleepy real fast. Uh, all right. Well, we've got two spare good bolters, so actually, Sargosian can rock a real big boy's bolt gun. Uh, so can Lockvik. Didn't we have some guardsmen in here? Thought we did. Okay. To battle. Oh shit. It's night time. Night vision enabled. Uh, it's gonna make life a little bit harder. The salamander didn't have his face. Hello, he's got. Well, it's kind of a grey face instead of a black skin tone. Um, I guess they had to find a way to actually show the features in pixel form. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, Jusp. Jusp has spotted. Oh my god! An armored Ogryn with heavy stubber. Yikes. Uh... Hmm. It's not the best start. Now, we have a limited time to get to the ritual site. If I remember this mission correctly. If we want to save the civilians. Uh, are Traitor Ogryn still good boys? I think they are good boys. Activate jetpack. I think uh, they just don't know any better, you know? It's not their fault. They've been lied to. Manipulated. Taken advantage of. Jetpack away! Oh. Oh, I misinterpreted that. Um... I... Th oh, no, hang on. That Ogryn is in that building. So he can look out the window. I don't think he can get an angle on me. I think I think I'm hidden. Uh, maybe we should. Well, that's why we've got the crack. The, the crack missile is a treat. Maybe we just don't go down that street to get heavy stubbard. Uh, maybe we we'll walk down this street instead. There's no bad Ogrins, only bad Commissars. <laughs> oh! It's a little evil Squatters. With a ripper gun. Bad Squatters. Squatters can be bads. That is known. Not much point in trying to frag missile on Ogryn, is there? Unless I eat my treat early. My crack treat. What do we need for an aim shot? 65. So that's like. Yeah, that, that should work. We can just step out the door and blammo. Next turn. Crack that Oggy. Hopefully he just can't see us. Right. Sit down, Squatto. Okay, Lewis can join the breaching team. Get on your knees, sir. Uh, take a knee. You're going to need it. Take Solopus with you. Uh, he needs a walk. Take the medic with you as well. Or the support servitor. Uh, then I think this squad's going to hang around and wait for that Ogryn to be dealt with and then go the other way. Okay. That's my plan! How can we see that guy? Is that from Captain Jetpack? Jusp. Activate Jetpack. Oh, no, he can't. <gasps> it's on cooldown. It's not like a OG XCOM Jetpack. <gasps> the Ogryn's gone. He's vanished. Oh, there he is! <gasps> okay. This is our chance. Get him, wrench monkey. Aim shot. Oh, no! Direct hit on the... <laughs> on the big lad! But he's not down! <laughs> oh, fuck! Okay, Jusp. Shoot him in the back, Jusp. Oh, he didn't even die. We've just wounded him. Oh, I feel bad for him now. 
He was a good boy. Okay, well that's... We did do it. The plan actually worked. Which is kind of fun. Now the way is clear. Uh, I'll leave like a few time units for snapshots. Capture him to save the biggins. <laughs> right, I think if Lewis keeps taking a knee, his stamina won't deplete too bad. Here to serve. Okay. Squad A advancing. Squad B only just leaving the the ship now. Uh, but we're all gonna go around the back door now, cause old fatty wrench monkey is in the way. <laughs> Taking up the whole door with his big butt. Oh man, this whole place crawls. Heresy. Whoa, Jusp! Just was getting knifed. Take him down, sir. Oh! Fuck. That guy had a bomb on him. No fatal wounds, though. Oh my god, Jusp. He's the man. Right, wait for backup. You don't need to go into this alone. Good, good work, Lockpick. Keep advancing. Zargosians. Yes, good work. God, these squats are pretty tough. It's four direct hits now. <laughs> Alright, chill it. You got him. You got him in. You got him. <laughs> Lockwick got his back tickled a bit there. Um, right, so Jesus. Uh, gotta get closer. Oh, that was a satisfying death animation. Enjoyed that. Is this the Chaos Temple or is this just a self storage station? We're about to find out. Yes, Lord. Uh, okay, get up here. Oh, no, wrong guy. Solipus, I meant you. Okay, my cell launcher reloaded. Oof. Don't you have to blow a door into the ritual room? I mean, when I played it two years ago, you could open the doors, but who knows now, right? Everything could be different. Oh, nice work! Stormtroopers are. Oh! No! Solipus! That is my second priest died on their first mission. <laughs> the priests have got a real bad <laughs> track record. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh my god, this guy just... Little squatty flamethrower boy just walked around the corner and ripperinoed our preacher man. A power user? Killed a guy on Overwatch, which I always respect. Everyone else is wounded. Oof. God, did we lose the servitor as well? We did. We lost the support servitor. Shit. But, Juzp just killed a second guy. No, oh, his third guy. Juzp is the coolest fucking guy there ever was. Uh, meanwhile... 
Good work, Wrench Monkey. Advancing. Back up, Jusp. Can't do it on his own. On guard. Uh, the rotor cannon seems like a good, good weapon to have out in the open. Thank you for your subs and donations. I really appreciate it. After this mission, we'll go through and read a bunch of them. Um, all right, we're going to deal with this. Here's a question: Are Zargosians blood angels? Uh, this one is, I guess, either that or the Zargosians, like, have red colour scheme and we've mistaken them for Blood Angels. This doesn't look like a ritual site at all. What the hell? Ah, this could be it. This looks very familiar. Okay, we'll get Squadosaurus Rex next turn to come out on this balcony and... Kill some fuckers. Uh, right. Well, power user. What do we need? 15. I'm going to go around the side. Hopefully they got less armor there. Hey, it worked! We're going to get out of this fire. So Jesus! Right, are we done? Pretty sure we're done. Uh, yeah, the B, B squad. Not quite as cool as the original A team. But... You know what? It's nice to see the stormtroopers kicking ass. Both of them are an absolute legends so far. I mean, you know, when a space marine kills a chaos cultist, big whoop. I expected that. When Man of the Hour Jusp kills like three guys and a Ogryn and is still hungry for more. That's what I'm talking about. Cornish Goatman. God, with the servitor down, we can't even can't even heal. Turn put out these flames or anything. All right, Squado, what do your elf eyes see? I think this is it. Oh, Squatter doesn't have a grenade. God damn it. Just Sir Jesus? He does. Right. Okay, Lord, we're breaching. Moving Let's go try and. Lamppost in the way. Lame. Advance. Nice. Works for Jesus. Uh, what are the different Bestigors called? Ah, okay. So Bestigors are the elite beastmen. Bestigors of Nurgle are called Pestigors. Um, Bestigors of Zinch are Zarngors. Bestigors of Slanesh are Slangors. And corn? Are they just called corn gores? Is that it? Is that boring? Surely they should be called gore, 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 gores of gore, gore, gore gores. <laughs> right? Pestigores is the best one because it's the pun name. Yeah, I feel like Nurgle aced it. 
and everyone else just kind of phoned it in. <laughs> Why are there no zesty gores? <laughs> exactly. Blood gores. Yeah, no, I just think gore gores. Clearly. Nurgle. Nurgle cultists and cornate. Aha! They're afraid! They're afraid because a stormtrooper on fire is about to kick their door in. Okay, we've got to finish this mission quick Ranger, before sir. power user burns out. Oh god, we don't want to hit the citizens. We do want to hit the cult of Nurgle. Alright, thread the needle, boys. Oh, Squatto. Oh, we can't hit him without hitting the barrel. Shit. Uh, well, get in there, boys. Oh, shit, there's more of them. Ooh! Okay, we'll just have to leave power user on Overwatch. Hope he's still got it in him. Should I just fire anyway? Force fire? Well, give it a go. Why aren't the Slanesh ones called Sexy Gores? I don't know! Horny Gores. You know, that's, that's better, right? Been a great turn, has it? Uh, where'd that bloody Gorgor -gor go? I was ready to missile him and everything. Get back here, you big goat. Well, let's hope they stay panicked. Excellent. I'd be tempted to panic, to be honest. If a crack grenade blew the doors of my hideout out, and then a stormtrooper and two space marines on fire burst in through the door, I'll clear this out. I'd be worried. Oh god, we can't literally open the door. Oh, the civilians! They're still in the way! Right. Wolf Lord Lewis, punch through that wall. Not enough time units. Do it try now. Hey! Good work. Uh, still can't see. God, why are they next to an explosive barrel? Right, let's hope this hell gun's enough to actually punch through this door. It is not. Uh, let's see if the bolt gun can. Shit. Jump packs. The one guy with the jump packs on the other side of the map. Oh, well, here's the gorgor. -gor. Wake me up before you go, go. Gozians, lead the way! Excellent. Let's just bring everyone else up. We've st if all else fails, I can just fire a frag missile into that room. Everyone will die. But maybe that's a sacrifice I'm willing to make. 
better that than that we let the cultists have their way, right? You can't let the cultists win. They'll never let you live it down. They'll just keep bragging about that time they beat the Space Marines. Oh, be so obnoxious. I think Scortosaurus Rex should be able to shoot past that, but I'll leave him on Overwatch. It looks like they really are quaking in their booties. Oh no! Power user! Oh! Didn't kill everyone in the room. Excellent work. Medal for you, power user. Oh. Still can't get through, though. Hmm. None may stand against space marines. What even is this thing? Basically immune to bolt of fire, whatever it is. Huh. Still more. <laughs> Weird. Ready for duty. What? Ready for some throttled auto fire? That fucking barrel, man. Maybe we can sidestep it over here? Okay, stop firing! Stop firing! Oh! Fine. We saved everyone! Hooray! <laughs> oh no, the Chaos Cultists. Turns out they had a, a, a rotary cannon all along. Who knew? Oh, they're not all dead yet. Yes, we saved their souls, if not their bodies. Perfect. They're with the Emperor now. It's what they would have wanted. Uh, well, you know, if nothing else, we uh, we stopped the ritual. Yeah, that's better than nothing, right? We saved the day! Hooray! Right, if you've got one cultist left hiding in a cupboard, you've, you've lost. That's my hot take. Just, just admit it. Stop being a coward. Accept your defeat. Oh, that's true. The the uh, citizens were tainted by the chaos ritual. Fucking hell! Ah! There's Nurglings. <gasps> Did they have? What is this? Was there still a ritual going on in the basement? Oh, what a cute little guy! Oh no, power user. Right, we have to win this turn. Or well, power user's dead from flame. Too much flame. The fuck? How tough are these fucking guys? Get him. Is that it? Did we get them all now? <sighs> I've got no idea. I feel like we got them all now. No! Shit! Power user! There's one little Nurgle... fucking Nurgle fuck. 
Where's that little bastard? Jesus. Okay, these rituals have changed a bit since I last played. Okay, somewhere with a door. I heard a door. God damn it. I hate, I hate playing funny doors. Hunt the one guy that's left. Ah, there he is. Get down here, Lockpick. Uh... Right, it's over for you, sir. Let's give it to just. That's gotta be it, right? Nope. We've stopped the ritual. Can we just end it here? Hmm. Could I have shot through the floor? I didn't know they were there. I thought I'd killed everyone in this room. Show yourself, you heretic coward. Just spread out. Hopefully they'll turn up. No one else is bleeding, so... Not in that much of a rush. But it's the other squad that's got all the uh, motion scanners as well. Annoying. There is a bug hunt mode, isn't there? If you get to like turn something, turn 20? Yes. Turn 20 it is. Then it just tells you where they are. He's there. In this building. Probably in that room, I'm guessing. Oh, there he is. Sweet. Uh, why is everything green? Uh, night vision. Because um, it's it's real dark. Except where, you know, there's fire. Ready to serve. Finish him, Squatosaurus. We did it. Hmm. 97 points. Wow! We killed 21 enemies! We took one of them alive. Hopefully the Ogren. Uh, five allies killed. Three by our own hands. Oof. Two of our own... God, so they, what, they were five? Six, seven, eight. There were eight allies here. I didn't realise there was a basement with them in. Probably could have saved those guys if I'd gone in earlier. And then two of our own units lost. Shame. Power user was doing well. Uh, not bad, though. Good stat increases. Uh, sell the chaos weapons. That weapon is tainted, but its bullets belong to the Emperor. Uh, we'll definitely sell makeshift grenades and pipe bombs. Oh, the Ogrim bled out. Shame. Uh, 
We got oh, it's a squat we captured. Okay. Yeah, we need a new support servitor. Oh, we've still got one at base. Well, we'll get a spare. That's fine. Rip. Rip Solipus. Rip power user. And of course, rip all those tainted humans who could not be saved. It was too late for those poor, corrupted citizens of the Imperium. Uh... Right, let's let's check out some of your messages. Thank you, thank you, Gunvardi Gun for subscribing. Thank you, Rufus the Hairy Cat Wrangler, closing in on four years. Have I been streaming for four years? That no, no, it's the children who are wrong. That can't be right. Stop telling lies, Rufus. Um. A Jungruf, thank you for using your prime. Uh, bunnies, thank you, bunnies. You say I may not know much about 40k, but I do know how to scream and throw grenades. <laughs> if I get in, may I request to be a lady? Glory to the emperor. Of course. Well, we've got a squad of uh, sisters coming in real soon, so we'll see if we can get you in. Thank you. Uh, Zara, thank you for the bits for another weak flesh bag for the emperor. And click on the black. Thank you. I am here to serve the Vampira. Welcome aboard. Uh, low fat salt. Thank you. You say, chump me up. I wish to have my second chump perish to the crabbening. There will not be a second crabbening. One crabbening is enough for one whole playthrough. Cribble? Uh, Cerebral? Cripple? Thank you for subscribing. Alex Ills UK, thank you. Say thanks for the entertainment. Always enjoy watching, even if it's YouTube or live. Thank you very much. Georgie Boy, thank you for the Prime. Robo, thank you for the Prime. Georgie Boy cheered bits as well, thank you. And Squidoo says, uh, another future chump. Hopefully, the new one will die as heroically as the previous. Protecting previous protecting precious items and weapons. Yeah, normally in like XCOM, items and weapons are more more precious than lives. But in this playthrough, lives are a lot less expendable. I don't know if we're going to be able to do that kind of thing. We shall see. Uh, McKellen, thank you for subscribing. Gravion, thank you. You say, greetings, Bempra. If there are any slots, jump me up. I'm ready to serve the Inquisition. Welcome. Overclocked Pixel, thank you for the bits. Say, so add me to the list again, Bepora. You, you got it, man. You got it. Troy Bone gives out a gift sub, thank you. Peter Hardy, cheers, thank you. Bear Willis has donated 50 bucks, which is very kind. Thank you, Bear Willis. You say, I almost never cra catch a stream live, so I'm celebrating this brief moment of peace with a donation before lurking back to the VODs. Never stop! <laughs> thank you, Bear Willis. <laughs> well, with your support, I never will. Thank you so much. We'll try and get you in. Uh, Gustavus X, thank you for donating. You say, gotta say, having watched all the VODs of the classic XCOM with you and Lewis, it really makes me, really makes watching these streams live feel like such a treat. Anyways, chop me up. Oh, thank you, Gustavus. Welcome. Uh, I done Ken, it's 15 bucks, which is very generous. And they say, I'm not sure if I'm alive or dead or never existed in this timeline. Submitting this request to the Imperial Records, so maybe my descendants will get an answer and get served drafting papers for me, for the Emperor. I don't think you're in this one. You may have been in the previous timeline, but we will get you on the list. Your paperwork has been filed. Please wait three to five generations for a reply. Oh, I'm just going to have to turn the heating off. This tiny little room warms up so quickly. You've been trying to paint some black Templars. Is there a way to make them less boring to paint? Uh, it's the little details, you know. You've got to stick on, glue on like a bunch of tilting shields and purity seals and relics and tabards and all that kind of stuff. 
Anything to break up the black. Ooh, we got a landed medium. Um, faces and bases make everything's aces. That is good advice. Fancy bases and detail on the faces and eyes goes a long way. As thin as it gets came back from its assault. The assassin is wounded. Still probably enough to make it. Uh... Hmm. I still don't really have any anti-armor weapons. Okay, Alpha Squad. See if you can get there before it takes off. Little Sparrow, thank you for subscribing. You say, oh, baby numbers, but at least I'm finally here. Gotta love a bit of burn. Two months is not baby numbers. Two months is very cool. Thank you, Little Sparrow. Uh, the Ronaldo donates and says, Bon, I'm back after that disaster mission versus the Zinch Crabs. It's not my fault I was a shitty medic. <laughs> I was a guardsman. What use is a medic if when you're shot at by anything as a guard, you vaporize instantly? Even so. Ronaldo is with you. Thank you, Ronaldo. Ghost McFloats, thank you for the donations. Very generous. You say, I was expected to die as a door-kicking space marine, failing to charge a demon or something. Oh, no, sorry. I was excited to die as a door-kicking space marine, failing to charge a demon or something. But I guess a dude with a plasma pistol has different plans. Let's see how it goes. Chump me up, Commander. Oh, Ghost McFloats, were you the one who got iced by that long-range plasma pistol shot? That was brutal. Hopefully we can get you back in. Georgie Boy has donated as well. He says, Ben, I'm loving these streams live. Really motivating me to paint for a three-day tournament I've got coming up. The second weekend of February. Ooh, yeah. Tournament is a great, um, great motivator. You know, like, nothing gets me to finish an army like having a deadline. So, yeah, crack on. Good luck. Three days, though. That's a lot of, lot of, lot of war games. Enjoy. Uh, oh, it's landed again. Fuck. I'm an idiot. I forgot they might just land again. Shouldn't have turned around. Ooh. Oh, there they go. And they're gone. Alright, turn to base. Hmm. Uh, hey, Ben, love your stuff. I've got a buddy addicted to the Warhammer streams. One of my buddies has a ton of old world fantasy for me. What do you think of Slanesh being lust for money as such, and not just regular sort of lust? Yeah, that is something that is overlooked a lot. Slanesh, like, represents all kinds of excess and desire. So it doesn't just have to be sexy times. It can be, it can be all sorts. It can be gluttony. It can be greed. It can be uh, debauchery. It can be, like, you know, sex, drugs, rock and roll, anything. You can, like, attack it from any angle you like. Pride? Yeah. Why not? You know, as long as it's just excess. Um, decadence, maybe. Like, all those kind of things. You can, yeah, go for it. It's the same with corn. Corn doesn't have to be frothing berserkers. Um, it can be, like, you know, martial pride or... Um, all sorts. Like, if you read, like, some of the older Chaos books, they've got a, a long list of, um, like, all the different sort of angles that the Chaos gods can approach from. Yeah, don't don't limit yourself. Use, let your imagination run free. Oh god, another Space Hulk. Jeez. Uh... Ruh Alright, 
we are gonna strip this bad boy down. Oh, fuck. Stripped every ship down. Uh... Okay. Get the boys in there. Uh... So, we're looking at 14 guys, 12 marines. wonder if it's worth packing the melter gun. Or the rocket launcher. The rocket launcher is just so heavy. Hmm. What's our, which, which one's the good bolter? The artifacts pattern. So let's take like eight of those. Might take extra ammunition actually. Because we've got to do another level. No point in bringing a sniper rifle into a Space Hulk. Can bring some heavy bolters. Uh, yeah, I just like the idea. I want the melter gun to be good. I know it's not, and it never will be. It's just wishful thinking, isn't it? It's totally pointless. Maybe we just pack double crack grenades, you know? Uh, definitely the motion scanners. Uh, where are the chainsaws? There they are. Need a couple of bolt pistols. Need more bolt pistol clips. Uh, definitely need more crack missiles. Definitely need more heavy bolter ammo. Uh, bolt pistol clips. Twenty of those. Missiles. Get another power fist. The chain sword. Uh... Yeah. God, oh, the melter gun just doesn't cut it. I'd love to have something to shoot through walls. But the melter gun is not it. I mean, maybe we bring it anyway and we try it again. Maybe we got unlucky. Maybe if I spend a whole turn just burning through the wall, it will work. We'll give it another go. Can't ride it off after one mission. Because maybe it just rolled bad, you know? Okay. We are definitely saving the game here. Does it matter if it's daylight, or is the, um, is the space hawk always dark anyway? Alright, does anyone volunteer for melter gun duty? I think of the new mandrakes. They're all right. They're basically the same as the old ones, to be honest. I don't hate them, but I don't. I'm not excited by them either. 
Um, trap, I want set. You know, one less grenade to fit the ammo in. Uh, Gortef. Gortef has no sniper rifle. You have to rock the standard. Ace Dragon gets the chainsword. Axel. Axel gets the flamethrower. Uh, no point in having a bib, but we may as well give Axel the bibber because he's often not going to be able to fire the flamethrower. Don't, you don't need that. <laughs> we don't know. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot to pack the um, stun rods. Shit. Oh. Where'd the other bolt pistol go? Oh, there it is. Right, I guess that's enough. It's dark. Right, so I'll go and open the doors. Is it always orcs in a space hulk or is it random? The chainsword runs out of juice. Fair. It's a fair question. Sometimes you just need need an extra knife, don't you? Oh! It's a human void crew. That's kind of cool. I would flame this, but we actually have to go up this way. So, uh... I'll go easy in this guy's ass. Alright, I'm a lot less scared now. Ready to serve. Burks in diver suits. A lot less scary than orcs. Uh, I think we sent everyone up top this time. The downstairs crew had a really bad time, didn't they, before? This is a lot of guys to squeeze through one corridor, though. Let's hope they don't have any big AoEs. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. The knife for when you want a silent kill, and the chainsword for when you want everyone to know you're here. Absolutely a, uh, a terror weapon in waiting, aren't they? I think it'd be a bit of a morale killer, watching your squad get ripped apart by a maniac with a chainsword. I absolutely wouldn't want to mess around with that. Big old pile up. That's my plan today. Yes, 
These guys have just got enough reactions. This is going to be so much easier than last time. God, there's a lot of them though, isn't there? That's a lot of hidden movement. Holy shit. What? It's not just boys. That's a Hormigant. Take him out, sneaky get. Nids. We got Nids. Uh, Do this in the right order so they can actually all get out. I think there's a guy behind me. Yeah, there was a guy behind me, but honestly, I think it's better if we just. Oh, he's much closer than I thought. I think it might be better if we just run. I don't think he can keep up with us. I really. Like, the longer we take here, the more gene stealers chase us. I'm just pretty much only interested in getting the hell out of here. I am worried about being such a clump. But I don't think Diver Suit Boys and Tyranids have got much in the way of AoEs. I'm gambling. Takes a while, doesn't it, to get everyone moving? <laughs> Take your jeans off and walk away. It's not a bad idea. That's all they want. They don't want to fight. They just want our jeans. Work dolphin safe. Right. See you later, you fucking nerds. Oof, we do need to control A. Eh? Not wrong. Thank you, Captain Ben, for the thousand bits. Benquisition. Benquisitors rise up for the Benquisition. Thank you. Oh, someone must have modelled. Gene Stealer's wearing denim. Surely at some point that must have happened. Just Hormigants. Hormigants for days. Uh, 19 to use a bibber. They're coming out of the goddamn walls! Uh, it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. How could that not just be fine? Uh... uh Get out of the way, Gortef. Famously inaccurate <laughs> of all the Space Marines. Bibber says yes. Uh... Right, we've got to save a lot of um, reaction fire here.
Gortef or Raven Guard? Gortef is. He's a Crimson Fist. And only pretty good with their bolt guns. Really letting the side down. I'm sure Super Blob is not the best formation, but honestly, it's all I've got right now. Never underestimate the power of Super Blob. He's got a sniper, not a bolter. No, I left Gortef's sniper at home on purpose. Because I figured that's a terrible weapon to bring into a space hole. He's got a bolt gun today. Oh, we wounded something. Okay, we just we just keep moving. Do not stop. Chin steal a contest. Okay, they're, they're down and below us. We just keep moving. Oh, hello. Christ. Uh... Trouble is, I've got to make room for everyone else to get through. What is the best way to get through here? Is it through this door? I feel like it is. How are you feeling, Ted Danger? You want to get knifey? I do. Get in there, Ted. For the con. Fucking job, Ted. Yes. Uh, right, Darren F. You got Ted's back. Hope so. Okay, Gortef, you're up next. You know what? Doesn't matter if you can hit or not, if you're gonna just be the scout. It's my new plan. Where are we even trying to get to? I think we're going this way. Maybe we just bundle everyone down this one corridor. Is this meant to be night vision? Yeah, it is, look. This is what it normally looks like. It's real dark in a space hulk. So it's kind of easier to see what's going on with with night vision on. Or do I ever spend an hour looking through my bits box only to throw the thing you wanted back in by accident? Right, so I I spent like an afternoon organising my bits box. I highly recommend it. I got like a pack of 20 little Ziploc bags and I went through and I clipped everything off the sprues and I grouped it into like, these are all the heads, these are all the weapons, these are all the little sprongles and bongles. Um, and I put them all in their own separate bags. Um, and I highly recommend it, because now any time I need anything, um, I'm just like, bam, I get the head bag. Uh, put all the heads in on the table and pick through them. The warriors will be it's a bit of work, but, command. you know, you can just, like, watch telly or listen to an audiobook or something while you're doing it. And, uh, you'll be glad you did. It's like the other day, a friend of mine started a Dark Angels army, and he's like, have you got any spare bits? And I was like, oh, yeah, I do. Check it out. And just, like, gave him the box.
What's the strangest bit in the bits box? God, depends what you mean by strange. What's strange for you? Got, got some weird bits? I can't think of anything particularly weird. Just anything left over I keep. Because it's always handy. I love converting. It's like my favorite part of the hobby. So I'm always like rooting around for bits. I don't even know if this is the right way. Better split up in case it's not. Gortef. <laughs> you hit him. It's not quite enough, Gortef. You gotta you gotta do better. But yeah, clipping them all off the sprues saves you like 90% of the space. Once you've done the clipping, like you can break it down to a much smaller box. Right, we're making much better progress this time. What was this, like, four or five turns in? Four or five turns in last time, we were, like, back here. Like, fucking around underground. Splitting squads in two, I think that makes sense. Right. Got six guys going that way. And we got the other, the rest of them all going this way. E Z. Guard the door, Prevuli. He's the rear guard. Oh. Gortef getting the fucking consequences of his actions. Just punch that nerd. I said, punch him. Oh, Gortef, you really are just, just a sorry excuse for a space marine. Uh, but I guess everyone needs, you know, the one guy to make themselves feel better. You know, do you ever watch Parks and Rec? Every office has a Jerry. And if you don't have a Jerry, then maybe you end up being the Jerry. Aha! That looks like an exit to me. How do I get down there? Just yump. Hope there's nothing weird down here. <laughs> Who's the Jerry in York Towers? I don't know. It's a hard one to answer. Depends on what we're doing, I suppose. It floats around, depending on the situation. I feel like that during... Um, like in the Gmod... Not Gmod. Oh, I was hoping that would explode. Uh, in the Minecraft building challenge... I feel like Zyrus, Xylus has become the Jerry. Everyone just is real mean about Xylus's builds. It's kind of funny. <laughs> but I wouldn't say he's, you know, that's just in that situation. It's not about, it doesn't go work that way for everything. <laughs> he's trying his best. <laughs> That's what makes it funny. It wouldn't be funny if someone wasn't trying at all. You wouldn't make fun of that. Right, this is a really awkward place to reach. Oh, who's got the melter gun? Where's Trapo? Trapo, I need you! There you are. 
Let's see if we can save ourselves like a whole turn. Trapo deploying melter gun. Not enough time units. Fuck's sake. Thanks, Trapo. Fucking job. No. Oh, jeez. Well, we killed hardly anyone, but that's fine. I'll take I'll take speed over wrath any day of the week. Ah, oh, coming out of the goddamn walls. Right. Let's do this, Trapo. Hey! My god. I guess it depends on the what the walls made of. Oh, and then Leona Frost, chop him up. Excellent work. Yeah, okay. Maybe it's just this, that particular thing we were attacking last time was, like, way tougher than it looked. I wouldn't say it's completely redeemed yet, but it's certainly earned itself uh, another chance. He did pick his bolter back up. Yeah, don't worry about that. It's all good. On a scale of Dawn of War 1 Marines to Astartes Marines, where do these guys stand? Well, the Astartes Marines are like fucking badass. Like five of them just took over the whole ship, right? Um, whereas the Dawn of War 1 Marines are just just cannon fodder, aren't they? <laughs> Basically. Uh, hmm. These guys are... I guess somewhere in between, aren't they? Like, Let's say if it's a scale of 1 to 10, if Dawn of War 1 Marines are like a 1, and Astartes animations are a 10. Then we'll say... Wants the knives away for the minute. These guys are probably like a four. I don't know. They can murderize cultists pretty good, but they, when attacked by anything bigger than that, they they do do die pretty quickly. I, I love both Dawn of War 1 and 2, but honestly, I think Dawn of War 2 might be the better game for me. What the hell is that? It's got a las cutter. Fuck. Okay, we've got to watch out then. Didn't realise some of these guys had, like, good guns. Uh, God, what is this lay? Ah! Shit! Definitely going to be gene stealers down here too. I don't even know what I'm looking for on this map. Did I ever play Battle for Middle Earth back in the day? I didn't. I think that came out when I didn't have a PC. There was this there's this big gap in my like gaming experience. Like I never played Portal or Half-Life 2. Cause there was this gap where I basically just didn't have a good good gaming rig. Or any consoles. So maybe it was around that same time. 
Because a lot of people have, like, recommended that as a solid game. It just never appeared on my radar. Yeah, I'd love to do uh, do a stream to catch up on all like the classics that I missed. Because neither of those games are like particularly long, right? That'd be awesome. We could totally do that. Is this it? When you play Terror from the Deep, this is where the alien base is. So it might be in the same Order place? Maybe? The guy with a melter gun waiting by the lift. What a fucking nerd. Uh... Okay, we're very close to the command room then. I did do a Portal 1 stream with Lewis uh, a few months back. So, you know, no reason not to do a um, Portal 2 at some point. I'd love to catch up, find an excuse to like go back and play all like the, those excellent games. Any game that everyone loves is a game I have to play at some point, right? I'm going to have to get around to Baldur's Gate at some point. That was more than a few months ago now. Was it? Well, it wasn't over a year, was it? Surely. Uh, when was it? Okay, nine months ago. that. That is a few months ago, because it was not a year ago. Uh, how about Frostpunk? Yeah, I played a bit of Frostpunk, only for like an hour or two. Didn't, didn't like, get into it at all. Didn't really see what the fuss was about. <gasps> ah! That's the Gene Stealer! Okay, they're putting up a much better defense here. My god. I'm glad we didn't get any closer than we did. Leona Frost, do you want to melee a gene stealer? Give it a go. Oh, it's not dead. Well, it's just a cultist. It's like a hybrid. Holy shit. Whew. Right, that guy's got a las cutter. Definitely got to kill him before we get any closer. Those things are dangerous. Battletech. I've, um, I've, I've played so much Battletech. I don't know if I can play anymore. I may have played that game to death. Oh my god, this guy just won't die. Fine. Peace Dragon. Get in there, sir. There died a hero of the Gene Stealers. Okay, we need backup. Lots of backup. Okay, we do not advance. We dig in here. We don't die to gene stealers. Oh, you missed my Rogue Trader stream. What was my take on it? Um, it's not a game I want to stream. I think I would enjoy it if I played it on my own. But it was too much reading for a story I didn't care about. 
but I think if I had if I could play it slowly in my own time without worrying about like having an audience watching, I think I'd enjoy it more. But I think it not it needed um it needed voiceover. Not only to so that it's not a ridiculous amount of reading, but so that if they were paying for every line of dialogue, they would edit it. And that game, for me, personally, needed some fucking editing. It's just so much pointless dialogue. But it looked very cool. It fit, felt very Warhammery. And if it wasn't so slow, I may have played more of the combat and got into the combat. But I played it for seven hours, and I got into, like, two fights that were, like, interesting. It's very slow paced. And what was filling that slow time was not interesting to me in the, in the slightest. But lots of people love it. It's got great reviews. The people who've got into it got really into it. I was chatting to one of the guys from The Longest Johns. He is loving it. I think it's just, uh,. You know, I, I don't love reading when I play games. I read a lot of books, but when I want to read, I read a book. And when I want to play computer games, I want to play computer games. I don't want to sit there reading. Someone has made text-to-speech mod for Rogue Trader. Really? Okay. That sounds cool. Yeah, I've heard the story gets really good, but the beginning of the story is not good. They really failed to like hook me into this uh, this plot, which I was surprised by. You know, when you have a three-hour prelude, you you'd think then <laughs> you got you got to get people into it at that point. Can't seem to find any old fantasy sets for cheap. But how did the war wagon work in the old edition? Does only one weapon attack, or did you get to use them all? You got to use them all. Yeah, there was like you got three guns and three melee ones, and you just like get one attack with each. Shit! One of our guys just got melter gunned. Oh shit, okay. Pravul. Preville? Has just had his whole right side melted down. <sighs> uh, okay, you're staying here. It's time for Ace Dragon to get in there. Get him. Oh, this wasn't the Melty Gun guy, though. Hmm. Okay, Trapo, you're up next. Uh, where the fuck this Melter Gun guy go? Is ours. Oh, there's another up. Oh. No, there is not another up. Oh, there's an up over there. Right. Okay. Well, we'll take it really slow. We'll leave everyone on Overwatch. And see what happens. Let's pull back. No point in getting jumped by a Gene Stealer. We don't need to be. This is corpse. Oh, did one of our guys just get in with Overwatch? Hey, it's Bree! Hello, Bree! How you doing? What were you playing? Thank you for the raid, my dude. We're taking things real slow as we explore a space hulk in XCOM. Steady, steady. No need to run into gene stealers if we don't have to. Is 
Somewhere in here is a secret... A secret base we're meant to destroy. Uh, can we turn the night vision off? No, it's still pretty dark. Are oh, you playing Dead by Daylight? Do you have a good stream? How'd it go? Well, this isn't the way. Uh, it doesn't help when you don't know where the thing you're looking for is. I feel like I'm in fucking Ikea right now. Oh, is this it? That looks like it might be it. Can Trapo destroy it with a melt gun? He can! Uh, is that it? I feel like I've done it, but also I don't feel like I've done it. Um, do you know what I mean? Are we legally allowed to leave now? Is my question. It hard ends when destroyed. Hey, Space Hulk! Space Hulk! Killed 22 enemies. Took one alive. I destroyed the command center. A thousand points. Ah, oh, nice. Bunch of bunch of equipment. Fantastic. Uh, Axel didn't get very much done, nor did Nivrat, but everyone else got loads of upgrades. Nice. Not a single gene was stolen. That's pretty cool. We've got three las cutters as well. I'm going to try those out. Uh, sell some of this crap. Uh, chaos sacrifices. They sound bad. Last pistols, we'll get rid of them. Um... No idea which of these things we need. Oh, we got a half a million bounty. Amazing. Uh, good fucking stuff. Let's go home. Ding, ding, ding. Got a million bucks. Should we spend it immediately? No, we'll hold on to it. The game did say you want to hold on to a million in case of, like, random events. Oh, God damn it. Is it worth making a research base? Maybe. I mean, we've, we'll see how we do at the end of this month, money-wise, because we've just tripled our research. In one day's time, up, we'll be at triple research. Um, we'll see if that's enough to keep us going. Now, for some reason I got rid of all the crew on my ships. Uh, okay. And a million's not enough for another base anyway. Definitely save it here. Uh, right, where do we get to? Um, I don't know if I want to do another mission right now. We've done, like, three missions back to back. Maybe four. I want some time to pass so we can get our new recruits in. Any updates on Tiny Tomb Kings? Um, a little. I've got them all sprayed and inked. So basically I've done the bone on all the Tiny Tomb Kings. They're all, I've got them all blue tacked onto a tray. They've all just been inked. So, um, now I've just got to go around and paint all the little bits of cloth and spears and stuff. Uh, so, you know, they're halfway there. Bone is the most important part. It's also the quickest and easiest. So it kind of feels like cheating. Have I painted my bases? No, of course not. They're not finished yet. Bases are the last thing you do, especially on um, tiny Warmaster scale things. Right, this feels risky. 
So this is a landed medium UFO. What are we fighting? Zinch sisters. Okay. If it's another fucking crab bus filled with a thousand crabs, I'm out. Um, like the last one of these we fought was an absolute flipping clown car. It had hundreds of guys in it. If we can kill that sister. Um, then we can do the chump's prayer. Uh, oh. Rip. Fucking rip. A perfect combo, wasn't it? It was melt gun the armor off and then assault. What? What a fucking spawn camper, man. <laughs> Jeez. You suck. Give me a minute. Ouch. Weapons ready. Weapons ready. Um Hit her quite a lot. Let them fall us. Like, can we kill them? Where's Trapo? Trapo's here. Should I do to them what they just did to me? Go get them, Trapo. Okay, that's 16 armor melting attacks. That's got to count for something, right? Um Nice. <sighs> okay, we melted his face and then filled him full of bolty goodness. Progress. Jesus. Sisters, sister's armor in this game is frighteningly strong. Uh, yeah, if he wasn't dust before, he is now. <laughs> oh, true. I think we can nade this guy. Uh... Maybe. Right. Right. Oh, you're kidding me. Bush in the way. Oh, here we go. This is how we deal with Bush. Oh. That hasn't dealt with it at all. <laughs> Shit. I thought I was being real smart. I was like, here we go, let's just get rid of all this foliage. Maybe now? No, log. Log in the way. Um. Well. Oh my god. Got to take out that sister. Uh, who's got the power sword? Oh, the Inquisitor has, haven't they? Should I run out there and start stabbing? 
I guess we'll get another volley off before we start wildly stabbing. Ted Danger knows no fear. What's the start? Oh, that's a wound. Calm yourself, brother. Fight straight. Stand firm. Why? Why is she bulletproof? Right, get in there, Ace Dragon. Show her your fury. Why? Why are you so tough? Oh god, we're relying on Gortef now. This is where we're at. She's literally taken 20 hits. <sighs> what is happening? Um. There she goes. Moly. What's that leave us with? Uh... Leona Frost ready to strike next turn. Aldrich Nerd ready for next turn. Medic. Expecting to be needed next turn. Uh, well, at least this guy hasn't got a flamer. Could be worse, right? Okay, he's backed off. He didn't like being in the burning forest. Right, we've killed one guy. We're one for one. Guess that's technically a start. Maybe we've got sisters instead of crabs. Uh oh, this guy is a flamer. Okay, Axel is on fire, but Salamanders are built different. I think he's going to be okay with being on fire. At least for a bit. Flamer do armor damage? Was that a complete waste of time? Uh, don't know. I don't totally understand all of. Uh, oh, it does a uh, two hundred percent morale damage. Uh, No idea. I think being on fire kind of ignores armor, though. I've got a feeling like this might mess him up. But we'll give him some bolt guns to be on the safe side. Who's this guy? He's also got a flamer. Hmm... Right, we might have to start looking into some of that special ammo. Fuck, another multi gun sister. At least we're far away now. Uh, this is a very short ranged enemy. Maybe we can just keep our distance, stay on the high ground. Darineth. Let's start lobbing grenades. Out of range. Shit. 
I'm not too worried, because they're, they're so far away. I don't think they're actually a big threat where they are. I do love clearing woods with heavy bolt of fire. That's pretty satisfying. Good old Gortef. He's like our mascot. Just having Gortef blind firing into the enemy. That's how you know where they are. Wow, it's weird fighting an enemy that's like as tough as I am. Chainsaw King. Uh, I'm gonna drop into the bunker, I think. And if anyone like comes by, he can like be like, "Surprise, mother truckers!" Whoa. Okay, surprise. That, that looks like that was my surprise. Hide from that. God, Leonard Frost. Uh, just guard, guard the flank. I reckon. Ah, shit! Oh, God. Oh, no. Okay, you're just gonna have to get close. Uh... Really gotta wear these guys down, don't you? Trapo's melter gun. God, everything's on fire all the time. Wonder if No! Darreneth! Oh Darreneth had was holding a crack grenade. Fuck. He's not dead though. <gasps> He's not dead. What even fired that plasma gun? Everyone's wounded. Maybe we just leave. We're legally allowed to leave. I'm pretty sure. Uh, Alright. Trapo. Your job. To melt that boy. And Eldritch Nerd. Your job is to fill that melted hole full of more holes. Okay, Leona Frost. Get onto his melty side. Didn't the melter miss? No, it chewed him up with a million melter shots. Chop through the melty holes. Got him. <gasps> Hair attacks with plasma guns. How can he see me? That's a wall, sir. He's got a force field as well. What a jerk. Well, there's not a lot we can do about that. The O's mean hits. Yeah, the zeros mean we've hit him, but we've um, not done any health damage. We've only damaged armor. If you bre breach the armor, it, flash it says hit. Uh, God, everyone's so on fire.
Ooh, yep, yeah, there we go. No. Armor, armor, miss. Armor, armor, miss. Critical hit, miss, armor. Alright, get out of those fires. Shit. Uh... Alright, we've got to get Darreneth out of there. Ted Danger. Always rescues his comrades. Uh, special delivery. Heal, heal, heal. Flammo. Darreneth lives. Ready for duty. All right, Squatosaurus Rex, just keep. Keep fucking shooting. <laughs> Got the only guys I've killed of I melter gunning. Keep plinking off his armor. to pour on some more flame. Let them fall before us. Okay, get out of the fire, Axel. Alright, the plasma gun has me really worried now. Luck, Pravuli. That's all we've got, right? Oh, yeah, we've still got Ace Dragon, but. Let's creep around that corner. God, what are these guys made of? They're so tough! Why do they have plasma guns now? You make it that so that Death Watch Salamanders don't get set on fire. Death Watch Salamanders take significantly less flame damage. Look, Axel's been in the fire for three turns, and he's only lost that much health. Whereas Leona Frost has been in the fire for two turns and has lost that much health. Um, so they do they do get a good damage reduction from it, which is nice. Nice little touch. is crazy. This guy's eaten two crack grenades, a thousand flamethrowers, and a thousand bolter rounds. Oh. Got him. Fighting fire with fire is terrible advice. <laughs> You're not wrong. It's really not working out so well. I have to admit. I'm starting to wonder if I have enough ammunition to um, to do this. I'll be honest. Don't think I'm going to send Darreneth back out there, but in case I do, I will re-equip him. 
Uh, how are we going to handle this? Because there's at least three or four more guys out there. If I can take out that plasma gunner, I'll be a lot happier. We steal their guns. Some of them. Only we can only fire the guns we've researched. So most of them no. But if we get the drop on them, the the melt gun does seem to actually work. And they seem to have really short-ranged guns. Oh, that guy's got a bolter. How? Oh, pinged off me. That's good. Uh oh, that one didn't ping off. Um. Right, Leona Frost. Please chop through the melty parts of this man. Good work. Okay, we're in the ship. Hmm. Um, should we just like let these guys? Should we wait for the fires to go out? I feel like a long range firefight, I'm definitely going to win. Did he get any wounds? Oh, one fatal wound on Trapo. That's annoying. And no Bibber either. The warriors of the Inquisition are yours to command. On guard. Have the medic make a run for the ship. Faith is our shield. Uh... Oh god, sneaky get. Three fatal wounds. Jesus. God, Sargosian's almost dead. Okay, trading fire at long range is not actually doing all that great. We are going to need more medics at this rate. Okay. You're doing much better, Sneaky Kit. Don't worry. Your armor is fucked, though. Okay, we're not re really winning a long range firefight then, in that case. Let's pull back. Oh, fuck. Okay. To stand in the fire. Jesus. First rule of medic school. Uh, even once we take the ship, there's still going to be like four guys out there. I'm going to try and steal a plasma, yeah. That's the dream. Who's got bibbers? Sneaky get, Ted Danger, and Axel. Well, Axel's wounded and in the ship. Uh, sneaky get, 
is wounded. Shit. Ted Danger is in the wrong place. Okay, well, Sneaky Git can deliver it and leave, I suppose. We can deploy Servo Skull. That'll help. Right, beep boop. Oh my god, there's a fucking melter gun sister right there, and a guy with a bolt gun. But we don't seem to be triggering their overwatch. Guess it could be worse. Okay, give her the melter gun. Back off. Fill her full of heavy bolter. Nice. Fill his back full of melter. Oh, Trapo! Shit. Rip. And his, it's his back that's melted, not his front. Double melties. Shit. None shall stop us. Right, just move the servo skull in the way to block his move. And we just cross our fingers. Alright. Prav. Prav is here. He'll save the day. They killed the servo skull. <laughs> Hooray. Alright then, time to stab him in the back with the power sword. Oof. Okay. Right, Leona Frost, you're on melter gun duty now. Uh... This is tense. Can't go out there with the plasma gun randomly killing dudes. Gotta kill that plasma gun first before we advance. <sighs> right, bib. Right, there's three guys here or here. Maybe split between two floors. <sighs> Yikes. God, that the fact that lifts make a auto gun noise is horrible. Why do they do that? Okay, time to open the door. There he is. The Heretic. Oh, it's fixed in the latest version. Okay, cool. That's good to know. God, whoever shoots at him first or, like, walks near him is going to get plasmid. Do I think Kill Team Cassius is a good kit? Uh, it's alright, it's nice. It's got a good amount of variety, which is nice. Um, I have it because I bought the that box set, the big uh, Gene Steel Occult versus Kill Team Cassius box. They're kind of fun. Um, I think pretty game-wise they suck, but
but um, they're a nice they're a nice kit. I mean, I imagine they're probably going to be one of those things that they n never support and eventually like take out of the codex. I would bet. So if you get it, you know, fully expect like to not get rules for them in the next edition. Seems to be the way they're going with like that kind of thing. I feel like grenading him is the way because then no one gets reaction fired by him, you know? Um, well, fingers crossed. Did he die? Or did he just fall down a hole? I'm not really sure what happened there. Didn't He didn't make a noise. Oh, crap. I think oh, we blew a hole in the floor. Shit. There's a flamey boy and a bolty boy. Um, let's try stabbing this guy in the back. Ooh, okay, power swords. Obviously good against power armor. That makes sense. Oof. Okay. Yeah, the Inquisitor is actually a bit of a badass. Uh, Alright, get out there, sneaky get. Tell me... Wow, nothing... Nothing's bibbing. Kind of a surprise. Does that mean there's no enemies, or they're just not moving? Kind of hard to be sure. Anyone fall down that hole? I think we might have done it. Where is the heretic? Oh, I think that's him there on the floor. There's a red cloak on the floor. I think we got him when we grenaded him. Hello? This is a real fucking wizard palace spaceship, isn't it? It's very zinchy. I'm into it. Yeah, he did die silently. Like a big nerd. He wasn't like a space marine who's like, I die! You know, that's how that's how cool guys die in this game. I don't like how the shadows don't go away. Uh, oh, that's how he was plasma gunning out the side of the ship. They fly? Oh, sneaky gets. He's been around for ages. Who even got him? Just some fucking nerd through the little vision slit. Jesus. Rip. Someone we don't even have vision to. Um, yeah, Rip, Rip Aroni, my brave, brave boy. Oh! Well, it wasn't him what did it. He put his back to us. It's good to know there's a side door on the ship. Where was Sneaky? Sneaky was here, looking out the window of the ship. Like that firing slit. Someone just sniped him through it. Someone we don't even have vision to. I'm going to send Leona Frost 
to go. Jesus, I thought you'd have run out of time units, but no. Kind of need his gun, that's the thing. Uh. Crabmen were worse, but these guys are so tough. They're hard to fight. Um, I was hoping all this fire and smoke would have cleared by now. I'm tempted to just click and turn a bunch of times until it does. Frosty's a bit, bit better equipped now. Uh, okay, right. Ship has been taken. A great loss of life. Wow, we lost like two guys. Wasn't too bad. Could have been a lot worse. That's for sure. Uh, Got plenty of wounded in the ship. We know there's at least three of them out there. Maybe more. When is this smoke going to clear? Holy shit. But at least the plasma gun is gone. That is important. Deploying now. Form the gun line. Boom. Get the wounded squad ready to come out if they need to. boys at? The flamer guy at the back, another flamer guy at the back, and a bolt gun guy. Right, the bolt gun guy is target number one. No! Oh god. Still can't see him. Fight back begins here. Oh, he's getting close. Hello. Uh, right, Gortef. What do your dog eyes see? There he is. I just walked in the fire like a flipping idiot. Perfect. <sighs> Feels good. Yes, brother. I'll clear this out. Let's wait behind this hill for him, and then jump out and be like, "Surprise, melter gun!" Moving out. How can you? How can you see him? There's like a level three hill in the way. Hide. Let's get on your knees. Duck. Can't see me. Hidden. Uh, okay. Still far enough away. 
hide from him. Ready to serve. Ready to serve. Moving out. He's climbing the hill. How close do I have to get to hit him with this melter gun? Uh, drop your bolter. I need 25 to get a shot. Okay, charge, Leona! That's nice. All eight hit. Armor shredded, hopefully. Let's fill him full of bolt gun. Heavy bolt is out of ammo. Deploy information. Priority target. Let him have it. Ooh, that one got through. It's not enough though. Oh, she stood right next to him. Um Okay, Squatosaurus. I need you. I need you to get some long-range heavy bolter goodness in here. No. Keep going. Oh, that's good. That's a hit. Shit. Okay. Ted Danger. Sprint, Ted Danger. Come on. Stand against space marines. Fuck. <laughs> these aren't light bolters. These are reg these are artifacts pattern bolters. They're like good. Like, these are the best bolters we can get right now. We definitely need to research these other um clips. We need crack and penetrator clips for sure. Um, well, fuck. It's all on Gortef. How you feeling, Gortef? You got this in you? Can't even see them from there. Grenade, grenade takes like a guy's whole turn and they can only throw it a small distance. Uh... Great. Thanks, Gortef. Don't know why I even bothered trying to get my hopes up on that one. Uh... Well, fingers crossed for Leona Frost, I guess. She lives! Somehow! <laughs> Somehow she lives! Oh, thank goodness. Three hits in the back. Ah, Ted Danger finishes the job. Whew. Okay, we desperately have to put this fire out before she burns to death. Did that guy just kill himself with his own flamer? I think he did. I think that guy just killed himself. Unless he ran all the way over there. I think that's a different guy. Okay, everyone is very low on ammunition right now. It's starting to get a bit of a bad feeling. That we can't take this last guy down. If we can ambush this guy with the power sword, we'll be fine. Ready to serve. We're almost out of melter ammo. We've actually used a lot of it.
Moving out. Uh, we're going to have to get the knives out soon. They might do better than these bolt guns. <laughs> they certainly can't do much worse. Okay, we're going to... Now we've got time and some distance. We'll get Ace Dragon to prime a grenade. Uh... There's another, another one down below. Oh shit, you're right, there is another one there. Fuck, I missed that completely, thank you. No! You're not allowed to do grenades too. Oh my god, of course it's a firebomb. What else would it be? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> ah! Please, put my fire out. Boop. Hang on, that didn't work. Put the fire out. Why isn't this working? It says target yourself. I'm really confused. Uh, the medic kit's not working. I think Leona Frost is going to die from incompetent medical attention. Shit. Stop, drop, and roll. Stop, drop, and roll. Uh, God. Two. There's at least two, maybe three of these fuckers left. I can't can't give her the medic kit. It's like locked. It's like bolted onto the character. Yourself, Fuck, Ace Dragon's gonna die from flames. Nine fatal wounds on Ace Dragon. Well, blaze of glory then, isn't it? Does he need 31 to throw? Little bush in the way. I can't I can't shoot at a tiny bush. Uh fucking rip ace dragon. Aldrich Nerd's doing fine. Go to spread his word. Oh my god. This is a fucking clown car of rubrics. No, oh, don't go near the grenade. Uh, if I get right close to him, maybe he won't flame me without flaming himself. Can't even just spray and pray the heavy bolter anymore. They got six bullets left. Moving out. Destination confirmed. I think it's I think it's time to just run up and knife them. Once he's crack grenaded, it shouldn't take much more to take him out? Question mark? That's all we got! Oh, and one of those guys wasn't really wounded at all. Axel isn't wounded at all. Get it back out there, Axel. 
can't burn us all. Exactly. I mean, they, they can. But let's hope they don't. Oh my god, is Eldritch Nerd fireproof? None shall stop us. Run behind, you impale. Okay, Eldritch Nerd's armor seems to be completely yes, fireproof. This is how we win. Um, can't check it here. Whew. Ace Dragon's not dead. If we win this round, he lives. That's so many hits. Finish him. Oh my god, we're doing it. Um Gortef with the knife? Do we just pray? Go on, Gortef. You've never saved us with your gun. See if you can save us with your knife. Ace Dragon's life depends on you now, Gortef. Okay, it was a long shot. We all knew it was a long shot. God, if Ace Dragon could just put his own fire out, we'd be fine. Right, Squatosaurus Rex, get in there with the grenade. Gortef, hold on to your butts, that grenade's about to go off in your face. Uh... Can we save Leona Frost, please? Still says it's myself. Literally can't save her. Something's broken. Uh... Oh, Gortef! Ace Dragon's dead! Gortef is dead! This fucking space marine! Jesus! Charge him with the power sword. God. This is a demon inside of him! What the hell? <laughs> oh my god, the mission will never end. This mission will never end. What is happening? Uh, Squatosaurus Rex, get in there. Oh. Whew. We did it. We actually did it. <sighs> Surprising amount of knifing going on in that mission. Oh my god, victory through knife. Jeez, that was grueling. That was like a like an endurance test that mission. Whew. Oh my god. The real demon was the friends we made along the way. Knifing armor not effective. Well, I would argue bolt gunning armor not effective. We've seen guys take like 30 hits and not die from bolter rounds. That was super rough. Five casualties are hard to replace. 
Uh, we got to get those Kraken magazines. ASAP. Yeah, it was really the Melter Gun and the Power Sword were the only reasons we completed that mission. I mean, almost everything we killed was because we'd Melter Gunned it or um, Power Sworded it. Um, very few of them died from like regular bolt of fire. <sighs> the chainsword. It did a bit of work, but it wasn't ideal. Like the chainsword, we only used it against things that had been grenaded or melted already. I don't know how effective it was against un unfucked things. Yeah, the Inquisitor's plot armor saved the day for sure. <sighs> Yeah, it turns out crack grenades aren't great against power armor. And Axel got six time units increase. That's very good. Wow. Five strength for Zargosian. Six accuracy for Pravel. Six for Squatto. Six for Eldritch Nerd. Sell some of this crap. Uh, corrupted melter beam. Harmonic melter ammo? No idea what that means. Chaos plasma gun. Soul Reaper cannon. We had a lot of good stuff. We've got some melter bombs. That's good. Don't need 300 Prometheum. Take like 150. 114 tokens for it as well. Not bad. Uh, some fancy las guns. Okay, well, we made a million bucks out of it. Wow. You shall all be remembered as the Emperor's finest. Oh, some real good guys went down, actually. This was some of our more veteran brothers. Look at that. Sneaky Git had 18 kills. Whew. F. Big Fs for Sneaky Git. Ace Dragon was doing well, too. And Trapo had been here. I think Trapo was one of our first, first Death Watchers. I'm surprised he only had five kills. I guess he got wounded early on and missed a lot of missions. Oof. How many of them were fleeing traitors? Well, that's a good point. You don't get to 18 kills without racking up a few of the easy ones. <laughs> there were some real good guys. And Gortef. <laughs> Oof. No. I think there's a option I need to change. None of our guys are getting promotions. I think there's a mod I've got to change. Uh, there's a thing about promotions. Someone told me about. Uh, it's not field promotions. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Manual promotions. I have to change this. Uh... Maybe we have to just do it manually. Hey, the laboratory's done. But why won't these sisters turn up? Come on, get in here. So, how do I give promotions? Do 
don't, I don't get it. Icon on the top left. Aha! Okay. So we can call them a Tempesta. If we want. Sure. Nivrat, you're a Tempestor now. Uh, Ted Danger deserves a promotion. You can be our Lieutenant. Lieutenant Danger! Uh, who else is real good? Darrenith? Oh god, Darrenith is out for a while. Yikes. Oh yeah, because he almost died, didn't he? We had to like drag his body out. Uh, someone's got to have more than 10 kills, surely. No, we lost all our good guys. Fuck. Yeah, we got... We're really low on people now. Yipo Dex can be the prime assassin. Why not? Uh... Right, we'll see how it goes. <sighs> What are we gonna do? We're really low on manpower now. Um, the shit. Well, what we're gonna do is take five minutes while I go and have a pee and rethink my life. I will be right back. Hold on to your butts. Welcome back, commanders. <sighs> All right, let me read some of your lovely messages. We spent so long doing missions. Um, I've missed it. I'm really behind. What did we get to? Uh, Rage Fearless. Thank you for using your prime. They say my face is my shield. Welcome aboard. Uh, JCB Brandonis. Thank you for using your prime as well. The Ronaldo donates and says, Also, I've joined Games Night as a member. I'm really hyped for more content. Here's hoping for more Conflict 47 type vids with mechs, etc. Old World pricing finally drove me to start a Kings of War army. But Old World is the hotness. Won't expect Games Night Kings of War vids soon. Yeah, I, I like Kings of War a lot. I've got the rulebook over there. Um, I've not played it very much, I have to admit. But it's pretty cool. I'd say it's a, pretty, it's a great alternative to Old World. Old World is expensive, man. Um... I've started painting tiny, tiny Warhammers. I printed out, um, I, didn't, I went to eBay and found someone who would print out some 10 millimeter Warmaster miniatures for me. So I'm gonna do my old world army in, in 10 mil. So it costs about 50 pounds, which is much better <laughs> and faster. But thank you for the support. Glad you're enjoying games night. Uh, we've got the next couple of games nights like already filmed. So we won't be seeing, unfortunately, won't be getting like, old world or Kings of War in the next couple of months, just because we have to get ahead. They take like a month to edit. And I still don't have an Old World rulebook, so can't play that yet. Um, I'm Naproxen. Thank you for giving out a gift sub. FKP for the win. Thank you for donating 15 bucks. Very generous. And you say, got around to continuing my 135 scale chieftain after putting it on hold months ago. Thank you for the background noise one painting. Oh, good job. Enjoy. Send me some pictures when it is done. I'd love to see it. Snixer has subscribed and says, heck, Twitch, no notification that the Bemperor was live? What is this warp fuckery? Yeah, Twitch ain't the best. I've got a lot of followers and nowhere near as many people watching. <laughs> I feel like they are not getting their notifications. But Oh, well. Uh, I'm Naproxen, thank you for donating. You say, Rick Priestley once beat me up in an all-male nude sauna because I said space marines were more suited to kissing than killing. True me up, Vemperor. Oh my god. I hope that's true. I mean, I find it very hard to believe, but it's a funny image that I can enjoy. 
<laughs> what do you think makes them better at kissing than killing? Tell me more. Uh, Biggie Wheeze, thank you for donating. You say, trying to paint Victrix Honor Guard and Marnius Kelgar as Blood Angels. Any ideas, Ben? Let's have a look. Uh, I need to see the models before I can commit. Copy the link. Paste the link. the link. Um, okay. Boom. Oh yeah, the old Kraglar. I like his old honor guard. They got cool helmets, which is important for a space marine. Space marines need cool helmets. Painting them up as blood angels though. I mean, sure, why not? Do whatever you like with your toys. It's just kind of tricky. They're covered in like ultramarine shit, aren't they? There's lots of upside-down toilet seats all over them. Uh, I would put them on slightly bigger bases. I do think Space Marines look better on chunkier bases. But other than that, I guess you've got three choices for the Ultramarine symbols. You can file them off, which is quite a lot of work. You can green stuff them over into like circles that you can put transfers on. Or you can just leave them and paint them a different colour. Um, I think the green stuffing them over into circles is probably the easiest and most effective looking thing. Unless you've got like a Dremel or a rotary tool and then you can like grind them off pretty easily. Well, whatever you decide to do, enjoy, have fun. And show me some pics when they're done. Uh, Laser Cat, thank you for donating. You say, hey Ben, you got to the stream a little late, so I'll have to catch up. Have an awesome stream. Well, thank you very much, Laser Cat. Dark Lord of the Universe has used their prime and says, wait, is this how you send a sub message? <laughs> it sure is. Welcome aboard. Uh, the real nerdy McUnderpant. Real nerdy McNerd pants. Thank you for using your Prime. Welcome aboard. Appreciate your support. Uh, Lamash Ducks. Thank you. You say, hi, Bon. I don't know if you've been asked this yet, but have you looked at the Lizardman and Skaven rules yet? I've flicked through them both. I've spent like five minutes looking through them. So I've sort of seen that everything looks roughly about the same, but I haven't gone through the details and spotted anything broken uh, or weird or inconsistent yet. Um... Why? I haven't got the old odd rulebook yet, so kind of meaningless until I can get hold of that. Uh, but why? Is there something you spotted? Let me know what you think. Malador, thank you for the prime. Ace Dragon, thank you for the prime. Woot woot. Oh, rip. Rip Ace Dragon. Uh, Muffin Man, thank you. You say, uh, does anyone else hear the Space Marines say, On God! Instead of, on guard! I haven't heard that yet, but obviously now it's all I will be able to hear. So thanks for that. Uh, Melanosevic, thank you. Alcast Games, thank you. Goblin Girl, thank you. Wireball, thank you for the bits. Trapo, thank you for the donation. You say, my Bemperor, I know it looks like I was filled with so many bullets that I couldn't possibly, but you see, I am an ultramarine. And have I therefore miraculously recovered? Please send me back into the grinder with my beloved melter. Or perhaps a multi-melter. We will put you on the wheel, Trapo. See how it goes. Jeez, that was 44... Did you die 44 minutes ago? Fuck, that was a long mission. Um, Fool of a Took, thank you for subscribing. And Hog Moneymaker, thank you for the donation. You say, let's get a chump called Hog in there. I'm sure they will bring you good luck with money. If nothing else. Thank you, Hog. Okay. Let's get into it. We we're all up to date. Now, we've only had... What? Nine days of game time past this stream. Because we've done so many missions. Uh, I kind of can't be asked to do another one right now. I want to make some progress. 
Um, will I use the Kriegers again? Well, the Kriegers at the moment are in training because they had horrible stats. They need to like level up a bit. So maybe a month or two in the um, in the training camp will make them good. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, so soon. Now, do we take a real understrength squad to go wipe out the ritual? I don't think we do. Fuck it. I have to take the hit. Oh god. Stationary large. I'm definitely not doing that. Hooray! The sisters are coming! Laz cannon. Oh, can I build... Can I research the Kraken rounds yet? Should I get those instead? There's an insane amount of fucking research to be done. I could go plasma guns. Uh, could go big boy melter guns. Do I have to do adamantium first? I can manufacture them already. Really? Uh, oh, you're right. Crack and penetrate around. Oh, that's the light one. Uh, there it is. You're absolutely right. So each component gives five clips. Let's use ten up. How long does it take to make? Oh, it doesn't take that long. Seven days to make ten? Now, is this going to be 50 clips? Or ten clips? We'll find out. 50. Okay, good. Order Hereticus assistance. Begrudgingly, and surely with an agenda of their own, the witch hunters have prepared some sisters of battle to assist your work on this planet. All according to pre-arranged protocols between the Ordo Malleus and the Ordo Hereticus for such an exceptionally dire situation. Uh, oh, Mark 5 Melter Gun. Nice. Mastercrafted light bolter clip. Melter charge. Oh, great. Got some good weapons arriving. Got some sisters coming. Chaos cult activity detected. Uh, we can make apothecary armor, that's true. I don't want to make apothecary armor. Because it just turns one space marine into a just useless medic man. We've already got a little Imperial Guard medic boy. He does a brilliant job. Yeah, I am playing Auto Xenos. That's true. That was a weird bit of text. Um... I don't want to do another mission yet. I want my sisters to turn up. I cannot build Terminator armor yet. Sadly not, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven guys could go on this trip. I can't skip another mission. Better just load up everyone we've got. Uh, but we can take the support servitors, which means, actually... Uh, Nivrat doesn't need to be a medic for this one. They can, like, rock a multi-laser? Should we try that? I haven't tried it yet. Why not? Uh, should keep Jub just with the uh, jetpack. So what does it actually mean we've got? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six marines to arm. We've probably got enough stuff, haven't we? Uh... Yeah, the missions are relentless in this. You don't have to do every single mission. I don't think it expects you to. You've got to like pick and choose which ones are important. Uh, I'm going to give the Death Cult Assassin a bolt pistol. Ooh, 
Ooh, it's proper, like, Sentinel multi-laser for Nivrat. That's a serious upgrade. Rax is going to be the Flamer guy, but also the Melter Gun guy. He's two things now. Both the heats. Uh... Right, wrench monkey, just take the standard issue loadout. Uh, in, get up the standard Thank issue loadout. Juzb. Oh, I forgot to pack a light weapon for Juzb. Shit. What's the recoil like? 40. Shit. Oh, no. Our jetpack boy hasn't got a gun they can use. I guess we could make him a melter gunner. It's a risky business. Uh, it's literally the only gun he can carry that we have. Forgot to pack his little babby bolt gun. No babby's first bolt gun for Jusp. Take me into battle. Whoa! What was that? Crit Finty. Finny? Finity? Crit Finity? Holy shit, giving out 25 gift subs. Holy fucking shit. That's very generous. Thank you so much. Make sure you thank them if you got one of those. Wowzers. That's incredible. Thank you so much. Well, we'll, get, we'll do this mission real quick, and then um, then we'll name all our new boys. Well, our ladies today, actually. What a hero. How you doing? You're at work. You'll be catching up on the VOD. Peace out. Oh my god, just drops a bomb and runs. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you. That, that's awesome. You're the best. We might need to turn off the notifications, though. Uh, let's go turn the alert box off for a sec. Because <laughs> uh, that's a lot. It's a lot of spamming. It's a lot of faith is my shield. Uh, can't see a building that looks like the ritual site yet. Might be over here. I have to admit, I'm not 100% sold on the jetpack yet. It's more kind of rule of cool. Advance. Deploying now, brother. Oh, there's our gore boy. I kill for the Emperor. We got Mr. Palpato back. So I feel like anything's possible now. Right, that's the edge of the map. Uh, hmm. <laughs> they can't stop doing rituals, don't they ever get tired of it? Well, we didn't let them finish their last one. You know, they didn't get, um, kind of blue-balled them on the ritual. They didn't get no satisfaction last time. Don't blame them. I'd be mad too. They were so close, and yet so far. Make your own way through, sir. Oh my god. It's a grav gun. On an evil sister. Okay, we're going to have to take a whole squad to worry about that. Get over here, Lockwick. Well, at least we can send a servitor with each group now. It's fun. 
Oh, why have they stopped saying servitor things? Ready for combat. They used to have fun little servitor lines. Right, what's this thing like? Auto shot or burst shot? Cool. Is that all? Um. How can I get this mod? I did download some mod, uh, but it doesn't work. There's no additional mods to activate the mod screen. Missing research at the start of the game as well. Um, well, you need, obviously, you need to get the community edition of OpenXCOM. Um, and, like, honestly, there's, it's probably best just to go straight to the 40k XCOM mod page. Go to the forums where you download it. It's got instructions on how to install it there. I just followed those. Um, ooh, good work, Squado. And if it's still not working, like do a clean install, wipe everything and start again if it's not working. Um, follow the instructions. If it doesn't work, jump on the Discord or the forum because they'll be able to help you better than I can. I'm a bit spooked by this um, Gravgun sister. Ready for duty. I think she's still there. No, she's moved. Trixie. Advance. There she is. Okay, now's your time to shine. Juzb. Go, Juzb. She been melted. Oh lord, she melted. Nice. What's up? Lots of silence today. Silent deaths. Uh, yeah, melted gun actually. Better than I gave it credit for that first time. Take it all. I don't take it all back. Take some of it back. Did I turn the music off? Uh, no, music's still going. I guess it's kind of quiet chanting music now it's switched to. So maybe it's, uh, maybe it's a little too quiet on the stream. Turn up a bit for you. There you go. Uh, right, well, I guess... The ritual isn't over here, which means it must be down here. So turn to turn the elites around. Get over here, Palpato. Get on the roof, don't worry about that. Quietly. Keep running. And Eldritch Nerd, get over we here. To spread his word. Hoping if we just use the elite, our elite guys, to quickly burn through this, maybe, maybe this mission doesn't need to take a long time. Multi laser indeed. Not so great at shooting through walls, but it's something. Right, right. Oh, grenoid. How are we going to deal with him? Uh, well, Target acknowledged. Which monkey is here? Ooh, okay, critical hit. That guy's wounded. Uh, maybe in can finish the job. Kill the big uns. Wish. 
So we can use this guy as a bit of a scout. Now we've got a spare. I will do as you ask. Okay, there's a lot of them in that building, but it's not too important. Oh my god, Targosian. Targosian took three fatal wounds from a ding. Got dinged by an auto pistol. Come on then, Rax. Slit, slit some throats. Deploying now, brother. Mm. It's too quiet. I don't like it. I think this must be the building. Oh, there's a boy. Here to kill random dudes. We're here to stop a ritual. No craven sex parties without me being invited. That's the Emperor's rule. How dare you. I'm surprised how few enemies there are here. Must be this building, right? Calm yourself, brother. I shall obey. Right, well, get your boo-boos kissed, Zargosian. So you're getting deployed. Yeah, definitely remember basement boys this time. Ready for, duty. for sure. Knock, knock. It's justice. We should hurry. Right. <laughs> was that my flamer or theirs? No, oh, that was theirs. They've tried to flame the salamander. The fools! Let's get this started. Blast him. Come on, Nivrat. <laughs> Don't creep up on a multi laser. That's how you get multiple lasers in you. Is there no one? Oh, there he is. I knew there was another guy here. Oh, shit. Is that a las cannon? Yikes. Well, this could be really flipping bad, couldn't it? Out of time units. Shit. Uh, let's just spin around and. Target acknowledged. Some business from the heavy bolter wasn't enough? Fuck. Jump pack. We don't have the jump pack. Do we? Oh no, the, no, it's over here. This is the jump pack. Good crap. Well, good luck. Lucky brave salamander man. Hope it's not a las cannon. Um. Doesn't look like a ritual room. A bit troubling. Well, 
Let's we should hurry. Of the Inquisition are yours to command. Hmm. Not sure about this. Not sure where their filth is lurking. Not where I expected. Bit worried about my poor old Salamander. Oh He's gonna have to start kicking in doors, aren't he? so quickly I didn't get to read it but Rax lives Rax took a big hit in the chest but he's alive keep stabbing good work Rax he believed in you but Rax is turning into more of a knife guy than a flamer guy <laughs> it's just so dangerous to fire a flamer in these tiny buildings oof Shit. It's a beast man. Beast man, beast man, what do you say? Oh, you don't like heavy bolters? Sorry. Could be like Repentia, but Chaos? Yeah, maybe. Alright. Let's run up these stairs. What's going on in here? Halt! Justice! Yeah, that might be it. Okay. Time to jetpack. Up, up and away. This won't take long. Hmm. This won't take long. Shit, there's an ogre in here. I didn't quite cut an entrance. Oh, I did. Don't have the time units though. All owe the Emperor a okay. debt of blood. Land the jetpack. Do not want to fight Ogryn a single handed. Okay, well, this isn't what I was looking for. And it's kind of massive overkill. Urgh, where are these Deploy fuckers hiding? Advance. Hmm. If I was a disgusting heretic, where would I be? Oh, fuck. It's another squat. This one's got a missile launcher. like penitent but Ready spelt wrong duty. is it just spelt wrong or is it meant to be a different kind of penitent oh, kill the bomb boy no bombs today thank you Orders. Fuck, Jusb. Three fatal wounds. No, don't die on me, Jusb. 
Eat poop. I have kissed all of your wounds and boo boos. Get stabbed. They will never um, Ogryn is tough. Whew, didn't even kill him. Right, I feel like we've been in every building on this map now. What happened to just? I think the Ogryn shot him out the window. Is it this bit? Was it right next to the Black Star all along? Have I been a blind fool of a took? Maybe those cargo containers. Yeah, it might be that. No, it's not looking like it. On guard. It used to be really easy to spot in the old mod. This update's made life way harder. God, I'd be annoyed if they were right there the whole time. Hello? Any heretics home? Uh, what do I need? 34 to shoot twice. Ow. Fucked it up. Alright. It's a stabbing. This is weird. This is really weird. Floor here? Nope. God, I feel like I've run the length of the map twice now. <sighs> uh... I feel like I'm just going to burn all the civilians out of anger now. It's taking me so long to find you, you're all going to get purged. Literally the last room I've checked, I guess. Grenade on the floor. Enjoy. Bring everyone else up. Uh, boom. Okay. The room has been breached. This is the room. Okay, we did it. We figured it out. Deploying now, brother. Three enemies here. Are they all cultists of Zinch? Yeah. Alright, let's get chopping. We'll try and save the civvies if we can. Won't let me stab. Advance. Uh, Ready to serve. Let's 
just get in in there. Uh, no line of fire. That's weird. Can't seem to target this guy. Hmm. Let them fall before us. Why is it no line of fire? We're going to have to kill the civilians. Priority target. Should we try force fire? Yes. Let's get the Inquisitor up here. Maybe they could do it. Feels like there's some kind of invisible wall in the way here. Yeah, that's weird. What shall I kill? Quietly. A swift death or a slow death? There's some bit of terrain in the way. There's so many people. Ah! There we go. Okay, found a spot we can attack it from. happening. Deploy information. Why isn't the mission ended? Hmm. What heresy is this? Oh god her. Didn't she die? Was it I guess it's a different one. Advance. Get stabbed. <laughs> Oof. Okay, we saved them. I can't believe you only get 40 points for saving the civilians. It's so much easier to just burn that whole building down and kill them all. It, I would rather not risk my guys, to be honest. Oof. You should get like 200 points or something. No deaths. Three points. The sister. Oh god, you only get four sisters? Oh my god. That took so much research. Oh. <laughs> Authentic 40k experience. <laughs> true. Very true. Um. It was a light las cannon. Wow. Okay, what do we get next? Uh, do we get some inquisitorial agents? Some pilots might be good. We need to keep constant recruitment up. Guard veterans? Ogrins? Oh, we've got to get Ogrins, haven't we? Pop last cannon down to 50. I think we just keep 25 guys constantly on recruitment. Last cannon complete. Okay, we need at least 60 strength to carry it, but it's just 220 damage. <whistles> Loses 3 accuracy for every 3 tiles. 24 range on a snapshot. Ooh, yeah, this is, this is, this is how you snipe. 80% of time units on an aimed shot. Yeah, we definitely bring one or two of these every time. We've absolutely needed this. Um. Oh, Goblet does 0 to 200% damage. Uh. Ooh, research craft last cannons. Uh. Oh, thank you, Cyclops Sam. Appreciate that. Hmm. The 
radical road. Very tempting. There's an insane amount of research to do here. Um... Hmm. What do you reckon? I'm not sure what to what to go for now. How do I look at the? There's a button, isn't there, to see the tech tree? Like, what do I need for Terminator armor? Melty guns is next tier. Okay. Meltagon will unlock a bunch of new stuff. Let's do that. Middle click a topic. What, so if I click on Chaos Plasma Gun? Okay, so we can't get regular plasma guns until we research the Chaos ones. It's Prometheum Lead 2. Uh, okay, Terminator Armour needs Prometheum and, I guess, Adamantium done as well. Uh... Wow, okay, loads of stuff is unlocked by Adamantium. Oh, I'm kind of overwhelmed. Uh, Alright, Terminator armor. We could aim for Terminator armor. So it needs Promethium, Power Source, and Mid Tier Research. Um, so Mid Tier Research requires Inquisition. Mid-tier requisitions? She's melt gun adamantium component. Okay, so we're doing melt gun. We'll do adamantium, adamantium component next. Uh, okay. That helps keep us a bit focused, actually. Fine. We can now buy LAS cannons. Amazing. Uh... I like two. Why not expand the research base? Well, we just got some money. The game says you want to keep about a million spare. So, I don't have enough money, is the answer to that. Um... Get ourselves another lab. Get some more scientists next month. How close are we to the end of the month? Yeah, let's power through to the end of the month. Deserter hideout. Fuck it. I'm not doing it. And the last cannons have arrived. This planet's going to shit. Aha! The Kraken penetrator rounds are equipped. Perfect. Uh, probably need some more melt gun ammo. Can't believe how much stormtroopers cost. It's bananas. Ooh, some chimeras are coming out of that base. Shoot that shit down. Hmm. What point do we declare exterminators? Yeah, it feels like it. Okay, I think we power through to the end of the month. We get a new round of Space Marines in. And then we name up the Marines and the Sisters, and probably call it a night. 
scans complete. Amazing. Okay, and then we go for adamantium. And then we build melter gun. Oh, one just arrived. God, the game doesn't do a good job of telling you, like, when you're going to get stuff for free. And when you need to build it yourself. Uh, and it's completed. Let's build the regular gun. Huzzah! 1,700 points. An extra half a million a month. I've got 3.7 left. Uh... Amazing. Everyone increased. Uh, Eldritch Nerd and Nivret have been awarded the Long Service Medals. And Zargosian is battle-tested. Amazing. Hangars are complete in Area 2. So we're going to build the... We're going to build two new planes. Shit, we need pilots. Fuck. We'll get um, two crack... I only just realised that. I should have... should have clocked onto that. Uh, right, we're spending two million on planes. Um, yeah, skipping missions isn't that bad. As long as it depends which ones you skip, you only lose a hundred points for skipping deserters, but you lose five hundred points for skipping a space hulk. Um. Yeah, we've got to get pilots in. We're going to have to pause adamantium components. Uh, request pilots. I'm just going to stick everything on it. Because that whole base is worthless without the pilots. Get one of every marine chapter. After gun completes. I guess while we're not building anything, we'll get a bit more crack and ammo. Uh, Oh, those are the Marines. Okay. Wandering Medicaid offer their services. Two wandering pilgrim Medicaid have heard your heard of your battles and offering to render their assistance. Are there any wounded that need to be saved? Are there any lives that need to be taken? Heretics to interrogate. Gripping bone saws and bolt guns, they piously inform you that they are as versed in methods of sacred torture as they are blessed amputation and the Emperor's final mercy. Amazing. Two si medical sisters are arriving. I love it. Deserters. It's going to have to wait. Got the guard pilots. Perfect. Okay, the planes have arrived. Pilots have arrived. Oh no, they're the Medicaids. Just need the pilots and we do a bunch of naming. Wrap it up. Guard pilots have arrived. Amazing. Uh, have they arrived? feel like they've arrived. Uh, right, they'll arrive in 23 hours. 
Weird. Yeah, the random events are cool. It makes the world feel a bit more real. And it's not just spreadsheet simulator. Adamantium components are complete. So now we can research penitent engines. <whistles> Mid-tier requisitions. Advanced ceramics. Devastator armor. Oh my god. Oh, I want the Devastator armor for the LAS cannons. But I think we have to have penitent engines. They sound fucking jokes. Um, what does it cost to make? 60 tokens, 80 components, 20 Prometheum, and 850,000 bucks. 50 days of engineering work. Oh, they're going to be good though. I fucking love penitent engines. That's going to be jokes. We need a trading base to purchase components. Okay. Can we afford what, a trading base? Uh... Yeah, we're going to need more engineers eventually, for sure. We need to do more missions to get more money, really. We... Well, start of next stream, we'll knock out these bases. Straight away. Just need those pilots to arrive so everyone can get named. There we go. Who did we get? Wow, we got six! That's cool. Wasn't expecting six pilots. Sweet. Okay, let the name-a-thon begin. Um... Oh, we got two more messages in since I finished uh, reading them. Solipus donated. Thank you, Solipus. And they say, Greetings, Bemperor. I have arrived late, as I am a busy boy. I assume my preacher with zero devotion has died <laughs> in an appropriately comedic and horrible death. But I hear there are new positions as battle nuns. Sign me up. Ah, oh, you did die a pretty grim death. You were um, with a strike team going to purge a, uh, a cultist ritual when a squat with a flamethrower jumped out, torched the whole group, killed, barely hurt the space marines, but you and the servitor that were behind them just got absolutely roasted in one shot. You didn't get to do anything. It was just your first mission. Whooshed. Pretty bad. But we'll see if we can get you into someone better. Um, Cyclops Sam has donated 127 buckaroos. That's incredibly generous, Cyclops Sam. I call up Sam. Thank you so much. Holy moly. You say, I've been a fan since the X-Files days. I never miss a VOD. Been waiting years to say it, but here we go. <gasps> Jump me up, Commander. Oh my god. A chumping years in the making. Holy moly, Cyclops Sam. Thank you so much. That's a lot of bucks. Well, I cannot deny you your choice. Let me know who you want to be. Um... What have we got? We've got four Battle Sisters, five Death Watch Marines, two torturing medical battle nuns, and six pilots. If you're still here, please let me know what you would like to be. That's incredibly generous. Thank you so much. I cannot truly explain uh, how much that means to me. Thank you for enjoying what I do. In the meantime, I need to get everyone else onto a big wheel Big random spinning wheel of doom. Uh, so we can fairly distribute all the chumps. Because this is all the chumping we're doing today. Uh, right, where are we? 25th of Jan. Change the format, that's so awkward. Uh, 
Uh, oh, Cyclops Sam says they're a corpse man IRL. Give me a healer. Quote, unquote, healer. Oh my god, you want to do some gruesome interrogations? I'm surprised. I thought you'd want a space marine. But I'm not going to argue. Um, <laughs> let's give you the Medicaid armor. Uh, Cyclops Sam. Bam. Acantus. Welcome aboard. Get a promotion as well while you're at it. Uh, we can't promote you because you haven't been on a mission yet. That makes sense. Um, also, uh, Crit, Finti Crit, Crit Finiti, who gave out the 25 gift subs. I feel like you get you get your pick as well. Let me know what you want while I make the um, make the spreadsheet of doom. It's going to take me a minute to like sort this out. The formatting has been absolutely ruined. Uh, okay, that'll have to do. And then the subs. Oh, they did say they would watch the VOD for, uh, when they they just pieced, they dropped the sub bomb and pieced out. Okay, well I'll assume that they want uh, Blood Angel. Welcome, thank you. get all the people who sub today so my uh the back end that i use to track stuff has changed everything uh change where they put stuff uh, just take me a sec I think I got it. There's a lot, a lot of you here today. It's really good. Making making my life a little bit harder, but I'm not going to complain. I very much appreciate anyone and everyone's support. Uh, there. Copy. And paste. Spin the wheel. So, who's up first? Um, doop, 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 doop. It's the Battle Sisters. It's going to be... Can I copy-paste? That's the real question. No. Okay. It's Gun Vardry. Welcome aboard. You are a battle sister. Bam. Spin the wheel again. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, it's I Dunny Ken. Welcome aboard. Delete that. Spin again. Number 20, come on down! It's Hog Money Maker. Oh no, you just wanted to be called Hog, didn't you? That's it. Hog! 
Welcome aboard. You are battle sister. Oh, you've got loads of choices on armor as well. Bloody rose armor, adeptus pilot suit, dark red armor, sorority armor, repentia garb. If you've been very naughty, you get the repentia garb. Um, right, spin the wheel again. Sixteen. So, and a lot. Welcome aboard. Oh, that's Quint that's already named. We've got a uh, salamander, who's FKP for the win. Welcome aboard. Wow, what a name! Sorry, we have to delete that. We've got a space wolf who is. Bear Wills. Welcome aboard. Thank you. It's Georgie Boy. It's also a space wolf. Now, why did I pick so many space wolves? They had a good buff, I guess. Georgie Boy. Do -do 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 -do. It's Peter Hardy. Welcome aboard. Right then, who is this? Oh, the other medic. You get a pack discount with Space Wolves. <laughs> oh, we do need some Wheelboy emotes, you're right. Uh, what was the next one? Got confused already. Uh, Malador. Welcome aboard. You get medical armor. All right, then, pilots. Rage, fearless. Welcome aboard. Goblin girl, welcome aboard. Alka has games, welcome aboard. Uh, it's Astro Sloth, welcome aboard. Fat, salt, welcome aboard. Ghost McFloats, welcome aboard. And that's it, we got them all named up. Was that a pilot? It was a pilot, that's right. So we need to shift two of these pilots to area two. Um, send ghost floats and low fat salts. Go. And then one of these doesn't have a real pilot in. What have we got? We've got a battle pilot in Ankrist, but then Sector needs to swap out its cultist for Alcast Games. Um. Okay, so that now means we've actually got we've got a cultist who can like join the battle now, and we've still got three spare pilots. So I'm thinking actually we transfer to Factorum A the three remaining pilots who are. Uh, Rage Fearless, Goblin Girl, and it's Astro Sloth. Uh, uh, 
They can go to the training camp, where they can improve their skills until we need new pilots. Um, and should we put, send any new weapons to to the training camp? Probably, right? Uh, God, I'm kind of losing track of what the fuck is going on here. Uh, we've, got, we've got too much crap. Way too much crap. I'll sort that out later. Whew. Well, there we go. We got another month done. We've got research finally on the go properly getting some we got through like a bunch of research in quite a short space of time and we'll have an we'll go another 25 later this month we've got good income coming from the factorum where our humans are training area two is about to come online as soon as those pilots arrive um we're in a really good spot really good spot can almost fill both planes now as well. We can have like Battle Sister Squad and Space Marine Squad. It's be pretty cool. What about naming the second transport? Oh yeah, we can do that. Sure. Uh... The Muffin Man. Welcome aboard, the Muffin Man. You're our plane. Nice, we'll figure that out. And uh, we'll load up two squads. We'll have a Space Marine squad, and we'll have a Sisters and Inquisitors and, like, Stormtrooper squad. And then the, um, one plane can go and do all of the, like, cultist missions and the traitor guard bases. And then the Space Marines can get sent in for the hard stuff with their new... Uh, Kraken penetrator rounds to fight space marines, their las cannons, um, melter guns. Oh, it's gonna be good. We've, we've, we've definitely gone up a tier in in technology. It's gonna be cool. We're off the ground. We've got, we've got to crack these bases. Uh, start of next week, because we've we have to skip a few missions to get to this point. So we have to get back on top next time. This is great. Good stuff. Well, hope you guys had fun. I know I did. Thank you so much for coming and hanging out, having a good time. Thanks, extra thanks, obviously, to everyone who subscribed and donated. I very much appreciate your support. Thank you so much for for making this a job I can do. I really appreciate it. Um, what are we doing next week? Next week I'll be doing Tom Warhammer with Tom on Friday, uh, Wednesday, Wednesday with Tom, and back here on Thursday as usual. It was a long stream this week, wasn't it? Nearly five hours. Holy shit. Um, should we do a raid? I think we should raid. Who's still live? Then the Archimedes ship mod, okay? Uh, not many people. Uh, Shadow's still live. Go say hi to Shadow. She's playing. Uh, which which Zelda is it? Tears of the Kingdom. Cool. Go say hi, if you like. Be nice, and I will see you next time. Oh, you miss Wednesdays because that's when your friends watch Red Dwarf. That's all right. You could you could just put on the vod while you're doing something else another time. Oh, you just got here. Oh, I'm sorry. I always stream 7 p.m. Uh, what is it? GMT on Thursdays. Yeah, Vodka Blinzy. Lots of love. I'll see you later. Goodbye.